Oh, okay. So this went live 50 seconds ago. Mm, is there a delay? It doesn't say you're live to me. It just says upcoming still. No, it's live. Oh, okay. You just got to refresh. There we go. Live. There we go. Yeah, you just got to refresh. Yeah, <laughs> it took a while. <laughs> Silly computers not doing exactly what we want when we want them to do it. Right. So, I? we have what many have called one of the worst factions. Oh, my. Indeed. And I don't think that's correct. Well, um, tell us why, beautiful man. We talked about this a little bit earlier. But there is a lot of hidden output here in efficiency. Um, the Dune Riders, for example, every, like, everything hits on fours. But the Dune Riders are 19 shots within 18 inches. Ooh. And they're sustained hits and twin-linked. Which is significant. Yep, yep. They also have a rule called fire support, which many of you might know from more heavy vehicles. So that everything they hit, right, or one unit they hit, you can reroll wounds for if you disembark from it. Scary! Now, if you combine that with the Skitari Marshal in a unit, that unit now has reroll to hit and reroll to wound. And in these units, you have a sniper gun with D3 damage, a plasma gun with 2 damage, and the arc rifle, which is very interesting against vehicles. Because that is the way you kind of reliably do enough chip damage to maybe kill it. Because it is rapid fire one, so two attacks within 15 inches, because they're all 30 inch range. Dev wounds and anti vehicle four up. Combine that with reroll to hit and wound, you might what? seriously like start doing some significant chip damage to things. Because you got six of these squads, right? One, two. There are five vanguard squads and one ranger squad. All right, but they're essentially the same, right? The ranger just gets the scout move, and the vanguard make me minus to my OC. Yeah, the basic weapon is different. Um, one of the basic weapon on the vanguards is anti infantry four up. Okay, cool, cool. And on the rangers, it's simply just strength four. Right on. And the rangers also do obsec. Oh, they do. Okay, which is significant in some matchups. Heck yeah! But the meat of the list. Is these guys the Taraxi? Aha! The, and and the way Admech works is that you have a lot of units that have interactions with battle line units, right? That's why there's such a big significance on having these um, these vanguards and rangers. Mm -hmm. Not just that they're good, but also that they combo off of other things. So what that does for these Taraxi is that if you're on an objective. They reroll once to wound. If they're also within six of a battle line unit, they reroll fully wounds. It's quite with nice. flamers. The flamers that That's you can 90s. get to AP one, right? They can get to AP three potentially if you have. <laughs> uh, if I get to deep strike in your deployment zone in the mm -hmm. top level of the building, and ah. I have copper on, and I have two CP available. They can be AP3. Because you get AP1 for the Doctrina, and then you have AP1 right. for the Strat, and then you have AP1 for the... Oh, that's disgusting. That is sick. All right. I'm liking it. Well, I hate it, but I'm liking it. Then we have um, the Marshals all have the enhancements, because they're all good. Sure. We have one that gives us redeploy. The good redeploy, after you know who goes first. That's important. Then we have uh, this guy. He gives Infiltrate. Well, I can throw him with these to infiltrate and scout. And scout. Uh -huh. Very and this awful. guy, who can just shoot, jump out of a vehicle, shoot, and then scoot right back in. Oh, that is nasty, nasty. Nice. Happy to hear that. And then we have these Sky Stalkers. Mm -hmm. Very cheeky and part of the plan. The plan. Indeed. So what they do is that after they shoot, they can move six inches. However, if they can end the move wholly within six of a battle line unit, they can move 12 inches. Very fast. So that combine that with my opportunity to pick up units every turn and go into strat reserve. 
I am scoring behind enemy lines all game. And they also have the ability to, because you can give them the assault weapons keyword, which means they can move 12 and advance and then shoot and then still move. So they can move exactly. unbelievably quick. I like it. My, en my entire army will have assault yep. almost all game. Makes sense these to me. Guys, little move blockers and objective guys, the little dog riders. Okay. Scout 9. Nothing special about them. Just Scout 9 and some dev wound shots. Scout 9 and dev wounds. There you go. Very fast. And they, they also have reactive moves. Mm -hmm. If mm -hmm. you move within 9 of them, they can move D6. And again, if they can end the move wholly within 6 of a battle line unit, they can move to full 6. That looks good to me. And then we have the ultimate move blockers. They are, depending on the edition, these guys are a menace, mm -hmm. but they are wet noodles. They will either give you a back rub or they will skewer <laughs> through you. Okay, fair enough. They are four attacks each. Only weapon skill four up, which is the big problem. Mm -hmm. Strength seven, AP two, damage two. Fairly okay. Sustained hits two. Helps a lot. It's a ton. But they're lawns. So oh, typically they will not use. I see. And here's the fun part against the uh, Chaos Knights, for example. Anti they are anti-walker two up. That is awesome. So those, yeah, okay, so those are a problem for a lot of people. Yeah, so seven wounds, three up save, toughness seven. Also two, leadership seven, leadership in Admech is generally pretty poor. However, if you combine <laughs> that with the fact that they have stealth, and then you can spend a CP to give them a 5-up Feel No Pain. That is they pretty cool. They take a lot of punishment before they die. That is pretty dang cool, actually. So that is the army. All right, so guys, Shetel just gave you guys a really great breakdown of Admech, uh, which is good because I needed to hear it too because this is actually my first time getting to play Admech, and I'm really grateful for the chance to do it with such a lovely fellow. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Important thing to note, my entire army, mm -hmm. except for the transport, has stealth. Right. That's part of the hunter cohort rules. In addition, I have a strat to loan up infantry, mm -hmm. to five up feel no pain, sterilizers and dragoons and iron striders and such. Mm -hmm. You can uh, advance and charge everything for one CP. The dragoons have it natively. Cool. You can pick up units, you can plus one AP, and you can plus one to wound. Now, typically, the plus one to wound is, is sort of the worst strat of them all, simply because it requires the enemy unit to be outside of six from mm -hmm. everything else, like the Chaos Knight Stalker. And with certain armies where you would like that, it typically doesn't happen. Got it. All right. Well, I'm picking a kind of an interesting new little take on an old orcs list here. So today, we're bringing the boys. I'm not going to go into quite as much detail as Shelter did, because most of y'all are probably a little more familiar with the orcs. But I do have the Follow Me lads on the Beast Boss, so these guys are fast. They'll be at plus two inches to move, so I'm going to make them red, because red things be faster. Then I've got two units of Grotz. One is going to be running with Zodrog Wartsnaga. I'll make them red, because that makes them fast. He gives them Scout, which is very, very cool. Then I've got another unit of Grotz. And then we'll have a 10-man unit of gets with Mr. Badrock himself. These bad boys are awesome because uh, they're just freaking awesome. Then I've got actually two 5-man squads of flash gets. This was something that one of our members in our Discord actually brought up earlier today. And it just seemed like a really interesting concept. So I'm running a 5-man squad of flash gets with a 5-man squad of knobs with a war boss inside each truck. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to like it, but it's a really interesting concept. So I'm going to give it a try tonight, and we're going to play around with it a little bit. So I've got the two squads of knobs with the war bosses, and they're going to hit hard. They're minus one to wound. They've got all the lovely jubblies. One unit of storm boys. They'll start in reserves. And then I'm just going to go and color coordinate all of my all my trucks. And then finally, we do have, obviously, big Mazrog Scragbat himself with the six squig hog riders and the ed wapas kill chopper for those sweet sweet dev wounds coming out of the hogs now one thing i'm really concerned about in this matchup is the sheer amount of move blocking potential that shuttle's army has as a matter of fact i'm pretty sure that if i didn't have zodrog this would be a nightmare of a of a matchup um simply because of the fact that you can move block the crap out of everything
Now today we will be playing a mission that is very likely to appear in the upcoming TTS tournament on the Happy Trump and Wargaming uh, Discord. So if you're not in, registered for that tournament already, you need to hop on in there and get in there. We will start the tournament two days after the Data Slate launch. We were really hoping the Data Slate would have been this Thursday, but sadly it wasn't. So we will start um, two days after the Data Slate does launch though. Um, and that is basically all I have to say to that. Today's mission, of course, is going to be search and destroy with supply drop. And that is going to be a lot of fun. And chilling rain is uh, the thing. So we'll go ahead and lock in our secondaries here. And I believe it's probably time for us to figure out who is the ultimate admin of the Happy Carpet Wargaming Discord. Hell yeah. So I'm going to roll a die. I roll a three. You roll a five. I roll a five. Would you like to deploy first, or should I? I win the little squeak check. See, you have no infiltrators or anything. No, sir, just scouts with the uh, Zodrod squad. Yeah, so ultimately it doesn't matter what I do. Basically. In that case, you can deploy first, good sir. Oh my. Oh my. Cool, cool. Put down my hogs. Well, you know, I'm going to demonstrate some actual tactical genius, and I'm going to really blow everyone's mind here. No one has ever thought of uh, such an incredible thing. I'm going to have my grots here. Now, with your strat, can you come bound down and turn one? If my unit has deep strike. Ooh, and that is just the sterilizers? That would be the sterilizers and sky stalkers, yes. Cool. And let me just think about setting things in strat reserve and stuff. <gasps> I'll do that one, and that one. Just make sure these bad boys are legal. Cool. All right, so you just have, cool, cool, one sterilizer and one sky stalker deep strike. Love it, my man. Yes, sir. All right, so I got my grots now. You have your grots. Now place my little grot equivalent. Skatari Vanguard. And you get to redeploy into strat reserve, but you don't get to redeploy like into infiltrate, right? Correct. Okay. Nobody gets to redeploy into in, re, in Nobody, he says. Because um, that is a rule that is used in the deployment phase. And when you deploy, it is no longer the deployment part of the, the you know, game. He says nobody. So I'm going to go and drop down on my hogs. And hogs are down. Yep, just spreading. Spreading thin. Here. Spreading yourself thin. I see what you do. I see what you do. Hey, Link has a question. He says, there's a Discord? Absolutely there's a Discord, my man. If any of my dudes in the chat wouldn't, wouldn't mind just dropping a Discord link. Um, there's a free Discord, and then... There's a $4 option to support me and my work that I do, where you can become a channel member, which will get you access to the members only side of the discord. And will also get you sweet, sweet perks, like have a fancy green name and uh, I'll think you're cooler. Not to mention you also get access to the upcoming TTS tournament, which is only for members. So Big Kahuna wants to ask, he wants to know, is the idea to keep the gifts in the trucks? The idea is to start the gits in the trucks, right? Because the knobs are great at clearing big things, but the gits themselves are actually a lot better at clearing small things than knobs are. Because they're going to have the four sweet, sweet attacks uh, that's going up to five during the wall phase. So they can get out, do some nice, do some not good shooting, but they'll get to do their um, ammo run for the lethals. And then they get to charge out and do some nasty things very, very rapidly. All right. I think we're just going to jam homeboy up in your face. Mr. Moss? Yes, sir. <laughs> Michael Ford uh, is saying it's weird saying you with no snow around you. So if you guys don't know, there's that been is, massive uh... <laughs> snowstorms in Norway. It's been insane. Dude, how long were you locked in your house? Like, were you actually locked in at any point? Uh, Yeah, I... <laughs> I, 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 I have to go out that door. 
<laughs> that's underneath my my veranda, so it's under a roof. So I had to go out there, trudge through like one and a half meters of snow, and then dig out my front door. Dude, and that's... I did that after like four days because I really wanted a pad thai. <laughs> pad thai. <laughs> it's what... <laughs> you gotta get those Thai Thursdays, man. Listen. See, do I do I want these here or do I want them elsewhere? I probably want them here. Um... Oh no! Let's put that aggressor back on. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna want some snagger boys. I think I'm gonna want them to be. I think I'm gonna put my kits right here. My shooty kits right here. Yeah, the big one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Will wants to say he uh, he respects how freaking cozy you're looking right now. I am the coziest gamer. <laughs> okay. Alright, so that's going to be Raiders. Nine and Scout move on those bad boys. Uh, I'll go ahead and grab... Okay, let's see. A green shock. These will be knobs and such. Uh, we'll come pop these bad boys right about here, I think. Let's see. Now, you are aware of my ranges, right? It is 30 inches on almost all the basic guns. It Got it. 24. Got it. Just just so you're aware. Okay, so you guys, you have extended range. That's good to know. Thank you. Indeed. And, you know, obviously assault and... All that. Water transports and... Yeah. All that awfulness. See, the thing we are doing here, right, is that we, we don't want to hide anything from our opponents. We don't want anything to be, like... Aha, I have this hidden rule, and therefore I brood you over. That That's not how anyone should play in good competitive Warhammer. Right. People should always sort of aim to have all information disclosed, because it's very difficult to remember every single rule, especially if you go in like a six-round tournament, seven round, eight, nine, right? That's for sure. You remember the basics, but then it's like... Oh, you could pick up those guys, right? Oh, you had fall back and shoot, right? Because you've never used it until that one moment where you needed it. So then, like, you, you give gentle reminders about, I can do this. So therefore, you might not want to do this. And that way, you know, you don't um, encourage people to do what's good for them. But, and you don't discourage them from doing what's good to them. You merely give them the information available on the board. Well put, gangster. All right. Let's see. My drop again, right? I believe so. I got one, two, three, four, five up down. One, two, three, four. Yeah. 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 Another unit of some gorgeous dragoons. These guys have such huge bases, it is ridiculous. Them girls got them nasty bases. Are they vehicles? They are vehicles. Right on. That is why they are a bit awkward, and I need to prioritize them a bit like this. Okay, so this truck... Probably gonna put it right about something like this. Arg! Come on, Chuck. Stop being a jerk. There. There we go. That's good enough for me. Alright, let's move some of these up. Like, like, oh, inside the wrecking ball. Tick. I'm gonna turn this floor off. He's not. He's going here. I'm just making sure, trying to get him not inside the wrecking ball. There we go. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, for Mr. Michael that asked in the chat, this is the Hunter Cohort. Hunter Cohort. Hunter Cohort. All right. Let's see. Can't see anything. Do, 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 do. 
You blind. You say WWE? You blind, sir. So probably with these, let's see. I could go here, roughly advance here. Roughly? And then I would need more to get in here. Be all up in my grill. But if I had a guy here... Behind enemy lines and deploy teleport homers. So if he's going here. fixed, I'm going tactical, people. I don't know if I could get everyone in. But I could certainly get a whole lot and be a problem. That's what you think. Here, here, but you are in the way, which is well played, intentional or not. What? 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 So the question then becomes: If <laughs> that could work, we will try. Does seem like it's kind of hard for you to deploy your army on these on on this particular deployment. <laughs> it is always hard to deploy and get these people out on the board. Bro, I feel yeah. I uh, have just kind of accepted myself that I played demolition derby. I think this truck's just gonna kind of go here. I'll do it like this with his rack and ball. Uh, I just wanna check my circle. Alright, cool, so that'll be screened out for turn one. Or very easy to do so for turn one, at least. You have another drop chair. And then I've got one more. Right. Let's do... Do -be -do -be -do -do. <laughs> Trevor, dude, every time Shetel opens his mouth about anything, he makes it sound scary to me, so don't, <laughs> don't feel bad. <laughs> That's, uh, that's why I keep saying everything works. Pretty much. I'm just going to go and start putting my dudes down now. Yeah, I'll put the dudes Because there's really only one spot they're going anyway. something and this basically makes it super easy for me to move them all behind line of sight turn one unless <gasps> unless seems like a smart choice let's see mine is right there isn't it mm -hmm. let's see there This is the mind games at work. The mind games. So this is why you save your infiltration stuff for last, so you can counter people's plays. Counters if, upon counters upon counters. Mind you, if your opponent doesn't have any himself. Right. You always probably want to drop your infiltrators first if your opponent does have infiltrators. That way you get to claim the infiltration zone. That way you can't hide over here. You don't know that. I can do whatever I want. And the way things interplay here now mm -hmm. is that if he goes first, he has to resolve all his pre-battle abilities first. Mm -hmm. That means he needs to scout before I do anything. Which means I can't scout here. Exactly. And then, after he's done, I can pick these up and redeploy them. Absolutely. Uh, let's see... I think we want Dune Rider 2 right here. Cool, cool. For that. Do. Big ol' models. 
They are a bit annoying on TTS because nothing is modeled f like no. There's no actual skeleton for the ramp. It's only there to look. Yeah, it's. Uh, TTS can only do so good. I like TTS. I appreciate it, but sometimes, you know. There are a lot of people that have done a lot of work into these models. They really, really. So have. I will. I will not complain. That's a freaking literally. And the fact that we get all this for what? What does TTS cost? Like fifteen dollars? Like, honestly, and it's, almost it's pretty sick. Always on sale. Yeah, it's pretty dang sick. Hard for me to complain. I could do it, though. I could find a way. Don't but think I can. Could, we could always complain about everything. Listen, don't... I play Warhammer. I, I I know how to complain about things. Trust me. We are Norwegian. We know... Uh, uh You're Norwegian, sir. I'm red-blooded American. Thank you very much. Uh, you've been assimilated. Don't... don't you don't shut me. your whore mouth. I am never going to assimilate. You eat waffles with brown cheese. No, actually, I don't. No, I, I've seen you. Don't lie. You've never seen it's me on... eat waffles with brown cheese? What it's on talking? stream. It's it's on stream. It's confirmed. It's out in public. Eating waffles you... with brown cheese? No, that's not you, true. You have, you have been exposed. <laughs> All right. We ready to rock and roll, baby? Out a skill check. Let's do it, Elves Lies. I'm gonna roll my die. I rolled a two. You rolled a five. Rolled a five. Going first for you, sir. All right. Please proceed to perform all of your pregame abilities. Let's see. Got a scout in here. Mm hmm. Just need to make sure that I stay out of nine of your models, which should be like right there. Mm hmm. I believe, yeah. Yep, yep. And then this guy. Should be safe, I think, outside of Mars. Yeah, yeah. Looks like. And then this guy probably can't make mine too, because he was in the back. Looks about right. And these gentlemen. I have a wild wife who just appeared. The girl. The girl. The girl of WTC. It's true. So they gave my wife an actual, like, name tag at the WTC that just said girl. It was pretty funny. Alright, now, Son is within nine there, so most we can do, like... Wow, wow, looks good to me, sir. Yeah, that's why we have the aura. Love it. Just spread out a little beetle. Little beetle. So that we cover that whole area. Sure, sure. Anything else? Yes, sir. Oh, you have more scouts. Oh, Dragoon's a scout. No, the redeploy. Ah, so it's not just Skitari, it's anything it's the redeploy. Uh, these are Skitari. Oh, are they? That's cool. It's one. Dos. Uh, sir, I see this being a fraction over the deployment lane. Yep, uh-huh, uh-huh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, actually... Actually... <laughs> Judge! <laughs> Which, by the way, Mr. Shuttle and I are both going to be TOs for the TTS tournament on uh, the Happy Cup and uh, Discord server. So if you guys have any issues, you can tag one of us, and then we will handle the issues for you. You've got one more, right? I do have one more. The question is, what do I do with it, if I do anything with it? Because I don't think it is necessary. What was your door? <laughs> they are mostly fine. Mm -hmm. They are mostly fine. Question is, do I want to shove these down the line turn one? Question is... Just get shot. Maybe just punk the truck. You can punk a truck. Let's see... Knobs and flash kits, knobs and flash kits. Don't talk about my knob. I'll you touch your knob now, <gasps> Jim. Oh my. Oh my. Oh, so I can touch hide them. Mainly, at least. Not 100%, but it is what it is. Yeah, let's put this unit forward. So they're going there. Cool. Then I guess these guys probably just wants to move up here. 
So, I'm gonna be like a lazy boy, I'm gonna drop them, and then I'll fix the guys who are in the back there to make them legal. Oop. And then he can't be inside a wall, so we'll just go back as well. Okay. So, I'm done with all my pregame stuff. We have a $10 super chat from Mr. Michael Ford, and he says that he needs to hear the loudest wall when I call it. Uh, hey, Karina, no. just so you know, there'll be a wall tonight, babe. Now, just keep in mind, Mr. Jonathan, uh -huh. the experienced broadcaster here uh -huh. will be able to do it so loud while also not uh, peaking the microphone. Impossible. And and getting impossible. auto muted. I'm going to auto mute the crap out of myself. Don't you worry. <laughs> All right, no, I mean, man. Like, you, there's a chance you might do it so loud that the software just stops it. That is po technically possible. All right, my doctrine for this turn will uh -huh. be uh, conquest. Yeah, makes sense to me. Or conquer, conquer. So you get extra AP against me and my deployment zone, right? Exactly, and all my guns have assault. Yep, yep. Now, here's the question. We have now started the game. We need to determine alpha and uh, omega we do so this will be one two this will be three four this will be five six would you do the honors that i can Choop. all right so this, this one disappears alpha. first that sucks everything's going wrong uh one and two three and then four five six yeah let me just rename it there we go Whoop. all right and this is the one that stays to the end of the game we will be crumping heavily doop doop Omega. Oh, let's find out. I got you for three hours. Let us see. Do, 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 do. So, we can easily get a double four on secondaries this turn. You can get holy with the mighty points, then? Oh, yeah. All right, all right. And I'll, and, I'll and I'll show you how. Let's see. I'm ready to see it. I, I have explained it. Oh, yeah, that's fair, because you'll get to the move them, and then they'll get to move six by being, 12 by being holy within. Okay, yeah, you exactly. can do that. Exactly. And then I can charge the rangers. Mm -hmm. Actually, probably would have been better just to let them stay where they were then, and that would have denied that. That makes sense. Indeed. Cool, cool. Well, not necessarily, because I can shoot everything else and then shoot the Skystalkers. No, that's also true. Let's see, I need... These what guys. do you need? I need to do... I got you, boo. I need to do this. <gasps> You're way too close. Oh, it's... Nah, it's fine, it doesn't matter. We know oh. where it is. You're, it doesn't matter. It's just because it's a funky model. I'm just being annoying. Oh, it must have been because I held it up and you have 3D. Yeah, exactly. There we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. The blockings of the movings. Yep, yep. So if anyone wants to see what move blocking work looks like, that's what this turn will be. You will not see me move out of my deployment zone in turn two. Or turn one. The question is, do we make space? This. This is oranges. And that is five. Uh, this is still part of my model, so. All right, fair. Yeah, but still, I can go on either side here. Sure. Be like that. We block this part. And then these gentlemen can advance, because they have native advance and charge, and they go straight up. Dup dup! You just be like, I'll just hold it for you. Right. And he gets charged to the truck. Whee! Let's see, we can go over here. Mm -hmm. By the way, I chose not to wah this turn. I know you're totally surprised by that. I am shocked. Absolutely shocked. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Squigog boys. Squigog boys. Do, do we do anything to stop you this turn? LC of DOS. Two. DOS is two. Yes. Two. Two. I was translating for all of our Norwegian friends who don't speak Spanish, so I was calling it two. 
Damn. You know how it is. That is very true. You know how it is, me being the ultimate linguist. If you just move six, we mm -hmm. get there. Of and course. you get to see. That seems like a good ish move. It's a good ish move. You're the beautifulest move. You're the Russell Crowe of moves. I do try to be the man with the moves. Well, they have been eaten by the floor. They do do that. Doo-doo. Doo-doo means poop. It does. <laughs> So this is actually plays pretty similar to the list that I built a while ago uh, whenever we were talking about how AdVec works, but you're doing a lot more of the Vanguard than, uh, than I was running. Yeah, we have, we've been enabled, yeah. essentially. Exactly. So I think I want to do that and then rotate like that. And then I should be able to use the remaining to just oh, you... touch that, just barely. I, I, I advance yes. six. Yeah. Cool, cool. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And now he's on the objective. Question is, do I do, do I go here to essentially force you to sit on it? Or do I move up to block you? Because I assume that you're gonna invest some stuff to lock down this objective. No, no, I'm probably just going to give that to you. It is the Omega. I am the Alpha and the Omega. See how it will go there and then. And say you rolled a one inch advance, and then no one will complain about anything there. Yeah, so that. Boop. Boop. Let's see, knobs are in here, right? And flash hits. Don't forget about flash hits being in there. I know. I know. I know. Right, 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 And these, and these, they're going to advance. They're going to go fast. Did I move 17? Pretty good. Pretty good. With my help, one day, maybe it could be the best. Yeah, with, with your coaching service, maybe I can. Maybe I'll start winning tournaments again. Uh -huh. I need After you winning more tournaments. Service, we'll get you to the top. I need you winning more tournaments, Chateau. It's it's not it's not good for the world when when the other Norwegians win. It should be you. Very fair, very fair. I, I don't need you running anything as oppressive as the freaking Necrons Awakened Dynasty again, though. <laughs> well, you you didn't like that one. No. <laughs> it is, it is well, actually, I had a really funny. good record against it with running the Custodes, but still, like, I didn't like it. <laughs> I don't like any list that just autom automatically scores a hundred points in three turns. <laughs> Let's see. You can't move through window. You can try. No, 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 no. See, the argument should be that I can just die. I can just jump straight through the window because I'm riding a giant dog. You should be able to, shouldn't you? I think so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, the trucks are positioned like this so mm -hmm. that they are less awkward to move with mm -hmm. the wrecking ball. Yeah, exactly. Because while it looks better to have things facing the direction they're going, it's not better. Game wise, <laughs> it's, it's not better yeah. at all. <laughs> see, so uh, I don't need this anymore. Oh, Let's... sorry, Mike. A uh, green truck is going to be knobs and gets. Let's. 
Advance these sterilizers. Sterilizers? They're gonna clean me good. Because the question is, am I safe sitting here? You're never safe. I mean, you're always safe with me, but you're also because not safe. assuming that charge happens. Wow, you know that's a, you know what they say about that. Go up, move block. You can't necessarily get your flash kits into them, you and I have units in the way that you need to chew through before you can get there. You know what they say about assuming things. I am going to take that risk. And so, guys, Mr. Shuttle here is, I would consider him, like, my coach. Because uh, we build things together a lot, and he is a wealth of knowledge. So I'm certainly not coaching him here. Because I he doesn't need it. consider it a, uh, a working partnership. A working partnership. We're partners, yeah. Karina wife. Oh, why are you standing on a chair in the kitchen like that? Okay. We're, we're... Never mind. That would be. There's no way I'd get away with that. I was thinking about being cheeky, but that was a. Uh... I'm not that safe. My wife likes me, but not that much. What? Does that actually give me anything? Gives you a big headache when uh, I careen and blow up and kill everything. Fair point. Very fair point. That's the limit of dudes. So it'll be yeah, it'll be seven flamers. Seven flamers. And it certainly helps to just ensure that these open up the truck. Hmm. 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 Certainly a possibility because if I open up the truck, I can start picking up tools. I don't think it is a bad idea. Be all pick, 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 pick. Should position, but position who where? Who where? Positioning doesn't matter. But by the way, everyone who's watching, what you're seeing Shetha do right now is essentially the main movement for the game. So what you'll probably see in rounds three rounds four rounds five the turns take two minutes or less of movement because this is really the only turn where movement actually takes time because if you do everything correct now which he basically has the rest of the game is more or less academic now there's some things that i can possibly do that doesn't mean that this is completely over here but that's why you're seeing him take so much meticulous time right now We are essentially setting up for the following turns. Exactly. So now in his following turns, it's yeah. actually, this is a great question because people are always, are always asking like, how do you get faster at playing the game? Well, he takes his time in round one to make sure everything's, everything's basically perfect. So that in rounds two and three, he already knows exactly what he needs to do because he's set it all up in round one. So rounds two and three take 2% of the time of round one. Yeah. So round one, you prep for the first three turns. Exactly. And then turns four and five is where your turn one is where your planning and execution skills come into it. Mm -hmm. And then turns four and five is where your reactive skills come into it. How do you secure your point lead or catch up and, and lower the differential? Right. Right. So right now we are playing search and destroy. It's supply drop. This is the Omega. This goes second. I don't particularly care about this. It'll mm -hmm. be five points. So I need to ensure that I can score to the end. And in order to do that, I need to keep Jonathan in his deployment zone for as much as I can. Mm. We got a question uh, if the crane can be used in melee. Yes, it's just when the truck is destroyed. It can be used anytime. Actually, It, it also explicitly says that it can... Um... Move over enemy units. Yes. Actually, really interesting, because uh, it says when any phase, just an orcs vehicle unit from your army with deadly demise is destroyed, which means, yeah, you could do it in the movement or charge phase when your opponent overwatches you. But you do still count as disembarking afterwards. 100%. But it could save your units from a charge. And it often does. Let's see. It is within 18. And that is fine. That is fine. Uh... Move 
this one. Well, then I believe it was a two inch advance. Looks like. Yeah. Then we can just shuffle these gentlemen around. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. They, they ultimately don't matter that much. They do matter. Don't tell them they don't matter. You people matter. Well, for scoring this turn, you little, you little turn. toaster boys, they they matter. Don't be because so weird. we do not score from our home objectives this game. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Beep, beep. All these oh. boys ready to rock and roll. That should be it. There are no units left behind. No Let us behind. commence with a shooting phase. I like shooting I'm going to declare that these server traders will do deploy teleformers and they touch your deployment zone. Makes sense to me. Then let's do some shooting. Shoot things. Let's do these sterilizers mm -hmm. because I assume that you are going to deploy things mostly here. No, why would you? So they will not have any targets if the truck goes away. Why would you assume things like that? That's nothing. That I so wouldn't do things like that. The range on the alpha is twelve as well. So that means uh, seven flamers. I will not spend any CP. Nerd. So or twenty-two. 22. Ooh, five more. Seventeen. Twenty-two. That's gonna be three wounds, right? Strength uh, should be three wounds. Yes. No AP. Take a wound. Or two wins. Okay. Yep. Now remember, if he had been on an objective, all of those would have rerolled two wounds. <gasps> that is a dangerous thing for these grots. Ponderous things. Well, the grots die no matter what shoots them, so I don't care. Fair enough. <laughs> I mean, you could sneeze at them hard and they'll die. So it's like, you know, whatever. Let's do... <laughs> This single taser lock, or this single uh, phosphor thing. Yep. Oh, they are IP1, by the way, for what it's worth, because you are in your deployment zone. Oh, uh, I don't know. I don't remember. So I'll just give myself another one because I didn't look. Uh, we can do the last five rolls, though. Two, three, zero. Yep. <coughs> And then, uh, blah, 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 blah. the one taser shot. Good, uh, good one roll. taser shot. Yes, that's it. And that's a wound. A wound. AP. That's a save. That was an example of TTS like breaking. You roll a six, a six, and then I roll a six. Sometimes yeah. TTS breaks. It it happens. <laughs> it's and been now. These these three phosphorus serpenta, whatever the call is. One hit. One hit. No wound. Mm -hmm. Yeah, strength seven, right? Yeah. So, strength buddy, uh, Zarn Zero has a question. He wants to know what's the mod that draws circles around the models. That's not a mod at all. That's uh, just part of the, well, the, the well, game. Once you yell, once you yell, it, it it is a mod. It is the yellow scribe mod. Right. So it's it's the thing that you use to put the stats on your models in the first place. Let's do these Cerberus Raiders into the truck. Yep. And no, if they you are, they, are, they are obviously doing the homers. Never mind. Yeah. 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 Let's do the um, Sky Stalkers. Cool. And if you are joining the TTS tournament, you do have to have your troops uh, yellow scribes in order to play. Uh, you can use rosterizer, that's fine, but you, you need uh, stats on your models. Four? 29 dice for that? Yeah, six shots each and five on the leader. Oh, wow. And then uh, sixes. Two wounds. AP1. Two and AP1. Five balls. Takes two wounds. Yes, sir. And then, as we discussed, they move! Oh, you can't be there, sir. That's way too close to me. Thank you. Now you're good. Let me put my deployment zone back up for you. There you go. Now you're good. There is one behind the enemy line for three mm -hmm. points because that's so. That's what's so nice about that. Yeah, dude, that's some really armies, good. Against some armies, I only ever do one, right? And I didn't even need the 12 here, right? That's what we discussed. I only need because because yep. of the advance and the redeploy. 
yeah, this army it looks seems very challenging to do anything against it when you go for a second. Yeah, it it is essentially an army that always has the potential to have a a, a very even differential. Yeah, right. Because even against amazing teams. armies, there's nothing that they can do if they can't leave their deployment zone for two rounds. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's cool. Right, let, let's do this. Um, this squad. Yep. Yep. To the truck. Into the truck. So the arc rifle. Mm hmm. Martial reroll. Mm hmm. Nope. The plasma caliber. Mm hmm. Obviously overcharging. Mm hmm. No, no wounds. Does it uh, hazardous? It's it does. Poof. Get out of here, nerd. Jeez. Where is he? There he is. Be gone. Get out of here, nerds. The Arquebus. It hits. It hits. It wounds. AP3 now. Oh my. Alright, what's the damage? Damage is... What? One. Takes a wound. The two pistols. They are essentially the same pistol. Okay. Then sixes. One dev wound. Dev wound. Takes a wound. And then... Uh, that should be all the special weapons. And then there are 12 of the regulars. 12. That is six six guys with two shots each. Oh, those are good guns. Or I'm sorry, that was good hitting, I mean. And then sixes. AP1. Two more, AP1. Takes two more damage. One left. And then you see, it's, it's all about chip damage here, essentially. Chip damage and board control. Chip, chop, chip. Let's do Dune Rider number two. Dune Rider numero you two. You are Rider. within 18, which means I get 18 shots. Two. Fours. And then sixes. Two. Sustained one. Oh my. And then sixes. One set. Twin linked. Oh. oh. Two at one. All right. And he dies. Does he blow up? All right. Come on. Go on the box. He does not. Okay. Okay. Place my models. Do, do, do. You can indeed yellow scribe on new recruit, Mr. Uh, to the face. It's actually much Jonathan, easier. Jonathan even made a video showing off new recruits just yesterday, I believe. It was pretty super dope, just so you know. Well, I'm kind of, I don't know if I can place them all, so I'm probably going to have to six inch it. If you can place one unit... Does that don't mean think you I only can. have to six inch the second? Maybe, actually, because it is two units. You know, although, maybe we can look up the rules real fast. Because sure there's, no there's no way I can place the flash kits. I might be able to get the knobs. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because the yeah. knobs have smaller bases. Right. Let's see. Destroy transports. If a transport is destroyed, so to set, up a, a set up a disembarking unit. So this on a per unit base. Yeah, you just get to move. You just move too far in the first turn. No. That's well, that's, uh, that's what that's they the do. Peril of not getting Kareen. Well, that's why I argue with Mister Felix, who says that Kareen's the best strat in the game. He's wrong. Kareen's a good strat, and it's very nice when it goes off. But anything that relies one hundred percent on pure luck is not the best in the game. These guys probably go here, and then we'll put these flash kits on over here. Uh, you know, maybe I put the kits up there. Can I fit them up there? That's probably going to be the correct thing for me to do. Then you're forced to charge them. And you'll kill them, but that's okay. There was one more kit somewhere. Here it is. Oh, just lag for a second. Drop that bad boy down. Yeah, so that goes, and then we'll probably have to drop all the knobs somewhere around over here. Do do do. Do do do. Nine inches is pretty solidly far. The, the problem with. Potentially putting it more passively, Will, is that he doesn't necessarily think I can shoot it down, right? Don't, don't think you can shoot it... the truck down? Of course I do. Well, well, yeah, but like, there's a chance I don't. Yeah. But, but I have to spend all the shooting that I have to take it down, essentially. Mm -hmm. 
And then once that happens, I have to charge them. And the space where I can charge them is relatively limited compared to the other models. Because if I am there turn one anyways, the truck only serves a purpose in protecting what's inside. Sure. So I lost uh, one flash kit and one took a wound, and then I took one wound on the knobs. Very nice. And then we can do... Let's see. Do we start plinking at the knobs a bit with these raiders? With like a couple of flash kits. Presumably we'll go away to this. Uh, taking away a single knob is a lot of damage reduction there, means that your potential calculations change. Um, so I believe we will do nine shots into the knobs, because I'm aiming for sixes anyways. Sure. So Will, if I had not put the truck there, the only other place for it to go would have been all the way back here. Which means all of his stuff would have just been even that much more stuffing me even more in my deployment zone. Two dev wounds on the knobs, please. Two dev wounds on the knobs. Oh, you got dev wounds on those guys. Interesting. Yes, sir. So he killed one. It was an anti infantry for it. You know, they're always minus one wound, right? No, no, I, I rolled sixes. Oh, it's just, it just straight sixes. Okay, gotcha. Straight sixes, yeah. Yeah, yeah cool. It's, it is the vanguards that have the anti infantry for it, but they cool. are not the dev wound. Okay. For what it's worth. Right. Imagine if the entire Admic army had dev wounds. You'd oh no, that'd be that'd be bananas. That'd be a ninth edition bananas. All right, let's see. There should not be anything else in shooting range, so we can do um, this charge. Charge clock. Can he roll three? No, oh, barely. He can. So we get there, should be within 0. 0.9, yeah, yep. You're good to go. All our measurements are correct. Turns out, when you pre-measure, things get easy. And now, just for the sake of it, we need uh, this back. Mm -hmm. So with three, he gets in. With a three... He gets in. Obviously, I have six inches of movement. Oh. It's just with regards to um, getting everyone in. Mm -hmm. There we go. When he said he has six inches of movement, he's referring to his pylon as well. You're standing on your own base, silly bear. How dare you. It is so hard to see when you, they. What you just can't you just can't that. see invisible things. I don't see it. I don't see what's wrong with you. I am not Superman, Jonathan. I do not have X-ray vision like you. Ridiculous! Of course you're Superman. Yeah. Let's see dragoons into uh, the gifts, I believe. Sure. Question is, should I? No, I think I just want to block Mosrog. To be honest, I don't think they do enough damage to be even considered. So we'll do flash kits. Okay. Or do I have to do Mazarog? I think you, you might not have to, but... Well, let's see. If I don't have to, I don't have to. Yep, but and if you see. do, then you do. Yeah, so, so we can go to there and rotate them up here, and that should be fine, right? Nope, it's totally within right now. Yeah. There. Right yeah. on top of my base. Can you have to back them up a little bit? Right there, am I? So, that looks okay to me. All right. Then, uh, six. Mm hmm. Maybe six. Touching base. Touching base. Touching base. That's, Touching. Also, that's also a good thing about these, right? It looks like it might be difficult to. to Very easy, um, To get them into combat. But it's easy to get into base to base. Super. Absolutely. All right. They do not need to charge. No. Um, you do not have CP to interrupt. So I will just uh, start with these Guitar Rangers. Cool, cool. Moving three and into base. Okay. And allow. Moving three and into base. Mm -hmm. Three. Base. base. 
and within two. Three and into base, we go. Ancient ancient Irish Celt says, I'm drunk, but my Black Templar playing mate and my pissed Imperial Guard World Eater are love your content, bro. Dude, you rock. Thanks, man. I appreciate you. Spending your drunk Friday night with me. You 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 chad. Really enjoy you. <laughs> there and then on the consolidate he gets in speaking of drugs that... wife may i have beer what may i have beer no oh <gasps> yes she brings me beer she does it blessed oh you better believe it i am on the water bottle train myself i enjoy water but i already drank my glass of water so now now i need drink i need drank fair enough Let's see, I am a little bit over that base. There we go. Right, that's more correct. Now we are legal, and it is important to be legal, gentlemen. You don't want the tax. Yay! Why? Let's see. Uh, Skull? Alpha is the only one within range. Skull, my friend. Put. So, two from him. Ranger reroll. Six is two, or is it fives? Ah, it's T8. One with yeah. Oh, you're T8, so yeah. fives, yeah. One at AP2. All right, takes what, a damage? Takes a damage, yeah. All of these are damage one. All right. One, two, three, four. Oh, he is no, he's not base to base. Actually... No, but he is within one. Uh, is he? No, one exactly no that is definitely coming out in front of my truck, so no, he's not. So, oh, the... Yeah, uh, yeah that's, is, uh... that's, that's not from my truck. That's like at least an extra point two. If if you're above it, it's underneath it, like right there. It's underneath the edge of it. Uh, I I don't care enough to argue about it, so you can do whatever you think is right. I just think that if let me just double check. Nah, I don't want to double check. Just roll it. No, it, it, if, no if you just... look straight above that point, it's underneath the edge of the right right there. Just roll it. It's cool. But it's not like it'll do anything before. Exactly. Us. That's why I'm just just roll it. It's fine. Threes with the reroll. Oh, that's not just in shooting. And five in. No, it's all attacks actually. That's pretty cool. AP two. Take a damage. One damage. And then one, two, three, four, five, six other dudes. Mm -hmm. And sixes. And another damage. I'm not even going to put that one on because it's about to heal it. Yes, sir. And then he moves the three. Mm -hmm go over here and we are fully uh, behind enemy lines with two units looks like now the dragoons dragoons 12 force with sustained two all right so two bonus that's good hitting and then, and then twos because it's strength seven with mm -hmm. and then six maybe three and they're dead do they have a six up in them? no but they have a four of arms oh ap3 yeah why do they get AP3? but you're because you're in your deployment zone Oh, very nice. I believe that is how it works, but yeah, you're dead anyways. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a relic. Yeah. And then I uh, do not fancy attacks from Mosrog more than I have to. Looks to me like that's your turn. I will take my four, and I will take my four, and uh, on guard, Mr. Jonathan. All right, well, let's see what the boys can do to compensate. So I'm going to draw two cards. Luckily, my turn doesn't take very long at all. So secure no man's land and no prisoners. Secure no man's land is basically impossible-ish. I'll get two points on it, I suppose. Um, Should be able to run something up there, I think. Yeah, yeah, I'll get the truck up there. That's not an issue. Uh, no prisoners. I should be able to accomplish that pretty easily. Um, cool, 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 cool. Do you have reactive movements when I move? I do not. Well, except for the dogs, of course. Oh, right, because when I move, then you get to move. Uh, D6 yeah. on them? D6, unless they can get wholly within uh, 6 of a battle line. Yeah. Got it. Right on. Um. Okay, so let's just go ahead and let you do that. Yeah, ranged attacks only, so it should be a it should only be AP two there. Okay. Well then I did get my sixes, gosh. Alright, so I'm gonna throw a squig bomb at your sterile Oh, there are two wounds each on the sterilizers? Damn. I thought they were one at one wound each. Uh, can you see them? 
Do you need visibility for something? No, nerd. I got squig bombs. I don't need to see anything. Hell yeah. Psh, get out of here with you. Do you need to see things? Do you do that after or just after? Just after. All right. All right so I'll go ahead and throw them at... Uh, we'll just throw them, I suppose, at your rangers. Throw one at your rangers, and then I'll see where I throw the other one. So the one missed, and then the other one goes on the rangers and hits, and kills two rangers. You do not have to declare them at the same time? I do not. Ooh. Okay. Then I will... Would you like to move? Uh, I would. Cool. See. The full six. Full six. That means did I want to go right here? It would be somewhat of a charge. Would help you get on the objective. Question is can I do it a bit differently? I don't think you can run through the wall like that, right? Oh, did I move through? Yeah. Oh, I moved through that. Yeah. I will be like right there to cool. prevent the truck from getting there easily. That'll work. I'll do that. Mm -hmm. And then this guy. Could be like there. Here. Nope. Ah. I think that was already a, it. Was, it's measuring just slightly inside your base, so I think you're fine. There we go. Cool. Oh, excuse me. Uh, I'm just going to see. That is 1.8. That is 1.8. So just a little bit of light. Mm -hmm. Just to make it a little bit more difficult to consolidate them to the object. Cool, cool. Makes sense to me. Put these bad boys right here. You can be like right here. Would you like to overwatch me? Uh, how far away am I? 11? Mm -hmm. So you get looks like one guy. 12, there's 12, yeah. Uh, that is a negative, good sir. <gasps> Weird. Alright, then I'll go ahead and... Unless... No, shooting face only. Yes, yeah, shooting face only. Let's go ahead and get some nice little flash kits up. And then these guys can move like this. And they can move like this. Uh, Mr. Sarn Zero, the numpad controls most of your things. So it is numpad 4 to increase the aura, numpad 5 to decrease, numpad 8 to make it square, uh, numpad 2 to reduce wounds, numpad 3 to increase wounds, uh, numpad 1 to bring up the uh, the battle scribe, the unit details essentially. So you can look things up in game without having to uh, check codexes, books, apps and websites. And actually, you've had a couple questions about TTS, bud. So if you would like, I do have an entire video on how to use TTS in 10th edition and how it all works. So you can go check that one out, and that'll tell you all the controls. I think I probably want to just go like this, because then that will go ahead and have all of that screened out for you. And then the truck can just kind of do a advance. Oh, fast track. Mm, big advance. Mm -hmm. I think that works. Um, then I'll have my let's go ahead and have I don't really want them to get out because you're blocking all there. This truck might actually just kind of stay where it is for right now. Annoyingly enough. Um, I definitely can't get all of my flash kits out of this truck. But Zodra should kill all the Skatari Rangers nonetheless. 
to three, so I'm still winning on fours with them. Um, and I think, yeah, that'll be all right. So then let's just have this truss. This truck will fall back. Maybe like this. And then I'll rotate them and open them like that. Okay. And then this truck will come to be right here. All right, you know what? This truck will just stay right where he was at the beginning. We'll move Zodgrad squad. Makes sense. Maximize the uh, impact surface, as it were. Yeah. So this essentially aids into my battle plan of keeping him in his deployment zone. Because mm -hmm. now I have forced his, his biggest threat against me, essentially. Mm -hmm. Because that truck is the thing that can get within my loan up and blast away units and vehicles. Because as long as you're in a vehicle, a, a dedicated transport against a melee army like orcs, you're kind of doing okay for yourself. Pretty much, and right? Can, and if you can move block them away from objectives like this, right? I probably can't stop that, but I can make it difficult. Mm -hmm. um, I'm just like explaining things while you move and such. I'm just saying because mm -hmm, I agree with you because I think you're you're an intelligent and then, boy and your voice soothes me. I, I do try. I do try. All right. So, so then... we've, we've essentially possession these, right, to react to whatever he uses to try and unclog. Because they can both diminish his forces. They can't outright kill him. Admic isn't strong enough for that. But I can do enough damage with enough units that are durable enough in return, right? It's all about being enough with Admic, right? The Omnissiah is just enough. Enough! Alright, cool. So I'm basically done with all my movements, so I will proceed to start the blasting phase a wee bit. Yes, sir. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and shoot all of your sterilizers. Would you like to loan up them? Mm, you have a little, a little angle. Oh yeah, you got a little wing right there. Beep, beep. Oh, yeah. Sure, a little wing, angle. nerd. You will not be able to. I will disallow it. So one CP. Spend it! I have. Okay, Number cool. One. All right, in that case, they will just shoot your, uh, whatever these things are. Uh, Sidonian Brigade. Yeah, those things. All right. Remember, they are stealth. That's cool. So I'll hit you on sixes. So I get five, and five times three is going to be 15. I'm going to hit you on sixes. I should get two. I get one, so that's two hits. And then they'll wound you on sweet, sweet fives. I get no wounds. And then I will have all of my squid cogs shoot your Sidonian Dragoons. So that's going to yes, give sir. me uh, six. Of I'll hit you on sixes. That's going to be three hits. Uh, wound you on fours. That'll be two wounds at AP one damage two, sir. You are anti-vehicle four, right? That's Not true. Anti-vehicle anti -vehicle four. Just checking. Mm -hmm. uh, AP something. Fours. We are good. Dope, dope. Then we'll have Mr. Mozzie. He'll shoot your sterilizers. He's got D3 shots and it's blast. So it's plus two. So it's going to be three shots. He will be hitting you on sixes. And then he'll be wounding you on twos, I assume. That's going to be two AP zero damage two. Take one, we will get rid of the useless alpha. Poof! You die! You died somehow! I've got all of these pistols, they'll shoot your Skatari Marshal, they'll shoot your, uh, I don't know, your Skatari Rangers. That's going to be ten pistols, they'll hit you on four, because I'm plus one hit, even though I'm, you're making me minus one hit. That's going to be four hits, strength three, so four is to wound. That's going to be you four wounds, sir. No AP? Boop boop. Pew pew. Take two. And then I'll have my Grout Blaster, he hits you out of five, that's a miss. Then, I forget, does Zod have a pistol? He's just got a slug now, so he'll hit you on five. And that's a hit, and he'll wound you on a three. That's a wound, no AP. Yep. Cool. Saved. Four of armor save on these boys. Okay, okay, okay. Then we got a truck, and it's got a bunch of pistols inside of it, so it's going to shoot all ten of those pistols. And those will hit you on the sixes. One hit, and it's going to wound you on a three. That's going to be one wound. Yes, sir. Then I got the big shooter on the Do inside as well. On the all missed. And then the big shooter from the truck itself hits you on sixes. That's one hit. It'll wound you on a three. No wounds there. Uh, okay, that's pretty good. All these knobs, they might as well shoot their pistols at your... I don't know. Doesn't matter at all. I'm not even going to shoot those. Uh, I think that's going to be all of my furious shooting phase. I know that was terrifying for you, but I'm glad you made it through. Right. Thank you. Do, do you mind if I do a little thing I forgot? What's the little thing that you forgot, sir? I forgot to move those, gentlemen. Uh, yeah, I think that's fine, right? Yeah, go ahead. 
Uh, you know, I actually already shot. Um, would that have changed anything you were going to do? Just be honest. And no, then... I would have literally right, just like put him like right here. Cool. Then you're good. Okay. Um, yeah. Actually, no, I think you got to put him back there because then I might have moved these guys over there. Yep. Instead, Very right? So, Very yeah. Fair. Very fair. Because that, that actually might have cool. changed the way I choose these, choose these guys. So, All yeah. right. So then it's the charge phase. So my knobs will charge your sterilizers and your Cerberus Raiders and your Dragoons. Would you yes, like to overwatch sir. me? No, sir. Okay. Phew, we did it. And see, that's how things go, right? Because it is so late. You know, Jonathan might be nice and do it, but he doesn't have to. Because at that point, it is like, I could have said like, oh, I just forgot to do it, right? Mm -hmm. That's on me. It's because right? he did say, "Do you want to move your dogs?" I said yes, and, and, then and he like, also moved here, and then I should have remembered to do it. And if it was, and I was still in the movement phase, is, right? And if I was still yeah. in the movement phase, I 100 percent would have been okay with it. But now that I've already gone and I've shot things, it's like ah, uh, I don't know. Because yeah, had you moved them when I done the this, the game then... state, the game state has essentially changed so much, right? That it would give me too much of an advantage, and would essentially be tantamount to cheating at that point. Well, it's not cheating if I allow you, if I'm cool with you doing it, right? <laughs> no, but, but it could be, right? Because right. If, you're a, if you're a player that is a bit intimidated by a guy that you think might be better than you, you're sort of inclined to agree because you might be psychologically intimidated by it. Right. Uh, so let's that, go and charge... That's... Sorry. Yeah. So I'm going to go and charge these hogs into both the raiders and your dragoons. So it looks like it's a three-inch charge either way. Yes, sir. All right, we'll take five. So we'll do this. We'll do this. We'll do this. And we'll do this. And we'll do this. And then we'll do this. And then we'll do this. Yes. That was long bases coming in handy. Always, always. Um. Okay. And then the grots are going to charge into your rangers. Yes, sir. Okay, we'll take an eight. Uh, we'll charge the, the stalkers and the rangers. Yeah, just makes more sense. Yeah. They're not doing that much. Right. Um, okay. For this, he'll be here. You'll be there. You'll be there. You'll be here. You'll be here. Now, bam, 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 bam. And then we'll get a few more of these bad boys. Eight inches, eight inches. Args. Do, do, do. You can go there. You can go here, and then you can be like here. Okay. Um, that's good. That truck isn't really moving. I was kind of hoping to charge him, but that would have been kind of hard to do. So I think that's all the charge. Oh yeah, gets have to charge your raiders. Yep. All right, that gets them a nine. Just remember for the movement Jonathan is doing here, right? He can't necessarily get on the objective. But he wants to be able to do it in the consolidate. Now, yes. if if the squig hog boys kill the raiders, the gits get to consolidate. They would have gotten to pile in, but you can't pile in towards an objective. So actually, I can't. Can cons no, the no. pile in. Oh no no yeah. Right. Gotcha. But the consolidate let you move towards objectives. So if you plan on moving six inches mm -hmm. towards an objective. You can't necessarily do that. You need to be able to do it on three inches alone. For example, if the knobs only had charged two inches, mm -hmm. they probably couldn't have done it. You got it, baby. So I think that's all the charges, and I believe it's time that we start uh, wrecking. You don't have any big combat stratagems, right? No, I'm only going to give those five of Phenom Pain. Okay, cool. Well, let's go ahead and start with my hogs going into those big boys. Yep. Uh, so I got five four, and then the others are going into the raiders. All right, so four times three is 12, and we'll hit you on twos. Uh, drop two, two explosions, and then we'll wound you on uh, fours. All right, that's going to give you six AP1 damage too. Yes, sir. Uh, AP1, it goes to fours. All right, so four damage. Yes, sir. Uh, don't need to do any order or anything. Takes four on a gentleman. Yay. Which gentleman do we take it on? Let's take it on... Gentile Toaster, thank you very much. This one. Then I have my hogs themselves. They'll hit you on threes. I drop four, but I got three explosions. And then these are string six, so we need on fives here. 
All right, so that's going to give you four more saves, AP1, damage two. Yes, sir. Force again. All right, another four, four damage. These I have to do in twos because they, the last one could... No. Um, no, no, actually, I don't. No, no. Yeah, of, exactly. of course. Take two. All right, so one is alive on one wound, and then the other three guys have to hit the other Cerberus Raiders, so I got two of them. These are the Riders. They'll hit you on twos. One miss, one explosion. Wounding on twos. Uh, it's going to be four saves, AP1 damage two. Yes, sir. Goes to fives. Right, that's two damage each. Pew, pew, pew. Meow, 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 meow. Okay, and then with a consolidation move, I don't really think I want to consolidate them because everything in your army ignores cover anyway, right? The, almost everything. The the vanguards have an omni specs that does it, mm -hmm. and the other units have flamers. Maybe we can do so it. To it would be for line, line of sight, of sight purposes. Yeah. yeah. Um, you'll still get line of sight, but you'll have to work for it a little bit more, I guess. Yes, sir. Okay, uh, then let's go with our knobs. Um, or you know, let's go with my, my Gretchen first. So I'm going to have all these Gretchen in the right herd hit your Skatari, and then Zodgrod will punch the Stalkers. Yes, sir. Uh, then I guess two Gretchen also have to punch the Stalkers. So we'll do Zodgrod himself first. Uh, He's got five attacks. Oh, yeah, because he space with there. Yeah. So he'll hit you on twos. I'll hit, and then we'll wound you on twos. Uh, let's strength seven plus one to wound. So that's going to be four saves at AP two damage two. Five ups, take four. Uh, those are the stalkers. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, damage two, was it? Yep. Then I will leave a single one. I will leave that gentleman. Cool. And then the, just the two Gretchen that had hit them also is going to hit you on fours, both hit, and then they'll wound you on fours. One wound, no AP. Cool. There we are. And then I'm going to have uh, one, I guess that's eight. Gretchen is going to be hitting you on fours. Yes, sir. All right, one explosion, three misses. Actually, the one there. And then strength two, so but plus one to wound. So when are you on fours as well? Oh, Gretchen are angry. Five saves, no AP. Ooh, is that into the uh, Rangers? Yes, sir. All right, kills All right, three of them. Three. And then I've got the Runt Herd himself. He'll have three attacks. He'll hit you on twos. Three. And then he'll wound you on twos. That's going to be three saves, no AP. Three saves, no AP. Whoopee. Take two. Damage. Two. Just one. Then the marshal takes a wound. Yay. All right, cool. Um, That's going to be that. So then we will do our uh, pylons or consolidation, I suppose. You could do it. Oh, who's closest to that one? Okay. And then you could be like here or something. And then you could be like here. Yeah, coherence is no issue. No. Ika an issue. Ika an issue. Oh, you know, I don't want to move him, so I'm just going to leave him where he was. Um, And then we'll do our next activation. So we'll go ahead and pile this knob in right here. I think I want to finish that little stalker off. Makes it a lot of sense. And then you can come right here. Oh, you know what? Let's dag nab it. Uh, who's Apparently, who's wise, you are to? fine. See closer to you, closer to you. So... One three, one eight. Mm, so I would have to base here. That's a little annoying. Oh, well. so I'll put three knobs into them. Uh, war boss goes into the raiders, and then the one knob goes. Here. Actually, no, I'll put war boss and one knob into the raiders, and I'll put two knobs into the dragoons. Makes sense. Yep. So we'll do the one knob into the raiders, hits on threes, one explosion, uh, strength nine. What's your toughness? Uh, toughness four on the four. raiders. Four. Alright, so twos. Alright, that's going to be four saves, AP two, damage two. Four saves. Lose two. Alright, and then we have the war boss. He's got four attacks. He'll hit you on twos. All hit. Wounds on twos. That's going to be two more saves, AP2, damage two. And do, 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 do. All right, kills the last damage one. Damage two. And then we've got the one knob hitting the Sty Stalker. Three attacks, it's on threes. Wounds on twos. One save, AP2. One save. Ooh. One save. Dope, dope. And then we've got two guys going into the Raiders. That's going to be six attacks. They'll hit you on threes. Oh, just dropped one, and then wound you on threes. Oh, that's just going to be two saves, AP2, damage two. There we go. That is one save. Yep, two D damage. And then can only be him. He, so he takes one, but that should be his last. That's Does basically boom, right. boom. Oh, do they explode? They have that little mice one, I believe. Oh, that's hilarious. Cool. 
Then Moz will just do his little pile on in, and he'll start slapping you. Yes, sir. So we've got six decks. Hit you on twos. Uh, we'll drop one, but one exploded. And then we'll wound you on fours. Okay, so that's going to be five saves. AP one, damage four. AP one. Damage four. four. And that is four. And then... I'll just come over here and see it. God, how do you do that? Um, just roll them four at a time, I guess. Yeah, I think you just actually have to roll them four, four at a time, which yeah. is a little annoying. Eight, eight, eight at a time. That was only six dice, but... Oh. Shoot. Right. Uh, he's got takes, uh, one wound left. <laughs> you got so one more dice to roll? That's seven dice, yeah. yeah. Oh, he survives. Oh, All right. And then he do definitely dies to the four next. Mm -hmm. So yeah. then we do uh, four more dice. Yep. Takes three. Three. And does that one guy explode? Uh, no. No. Okay. And then I've got three attacks with Big Choppa. They'll hit you on threes. Uh, four hits. And then I'll wound you on fours. Uh, that's going to be ten dev wounds. And then you've got one save, AP2, damage five. Ten dev wounds! Right, so that's fifteen damage. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if he's really going to make it, bro. <laughs> Let's do it! I believe! <laughs> and then sometimes the Mazrog does that. And uh, I don't think I'm actually going to consolidate onto the objective here. I don't think you can. Uh, no, I totally could, but I'm not going to. I'm just yes, going to end right here. You there's... have to be on the objective if you consolidate towards it. Oh, do you? Ha oh, yeah, that's right. You do have to end it. I don't think I want to, because if I do, that can get you, like, reroll wound rolls and other nonsense. Well, I don't care and about the reroll exactly. wound rolls, to be honest with you. But let's see, it can get you over. Oh, and you don't need overrolling force. Yeah, I will move it. That's fine. Because I don't actually care about this guy. Fair enough. Um, yeah. He's barely touching right there. Yep. Just just slightly on it. Oh, I'm on the corner edge there. So I don't want to be on that right in there. So we'll just do shift him like that. Okay. And then, oh, maybe I can't do that because it looks like I'm not on it. If I get all the way down. No, oh, I don't think I'm on it. You are not, yeah. Right, so then we'll just put him right back where he was. Fair enough. Okay. Uh, then I think that was... Oh, yeah. Then I... uh, Oh, these guys are already dead, so then these guys could just consolidate yep, so on. Uh, consolidate. Mm -hmm. There's just three inches there, and that will get me two points for secure. Not exactly what I want, but it is something. I mean, seven points turn one. Yeah, it's not It's not bad. No, I'm not, I'm not too upset with it. Uh, so I did clap back a little bit. I'm almost out of my hole. Uh, I'm not going to score any secondary, any primary in round two, which is a little, a bit of a thing. But we will see how this goes in round two. Um, because it is, after all, to five round. Yeah, and I do believe it's probably... It's see, fine this gentleman all. needs to battle shock. Yeah, it is ten points to me for my yeah. primary. For yeah, worth. it is. And I do believe it's probably... You know, I don't, I don't think I'm going to wah. I'm not wahing yet. Alrighty. Let's see, he passed his battle shock, which is great. cool. Uh, which means I don't need to drop anything for the consideration of. Uh, oh, I also need to roll see my Gretchen get me get me CP. Let me put that in. They did, so I'm just gonna put myself up to one more CP. Yes, sir. Sorry about that. So this guy stalker can easily get away. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Michael. The wall will come, but round two was not time for it. <laughs> I know you wanted it, bro. It's coming. I promise. You've earned it. Nah, I got you all blocked out. Yes, sir. The question then is... Can he survive? Probably not. Nah, he dies if he stays there. You got a much better chance of surviving by doing the desperate breakout test. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm just trying to solve for the teleport homer. Right. Uh, yeah, I, mean, I guess these guys could do it, but you probably want to shoot with them, right? Absolutely. I'm thinking it might be a three. That is also acceptable. 
That is absolutely acceptable. See, you said no war this turn. Yeah, no war this turn. Hmm, yes, yes. So what do we kill this turn is a good question. Dude, I think we just got Will convinced that Zod is good. Yeah, bro, Zodgrod is a pimp. He's a total badass. Uh, one of the funniest things in the existence is to watch Zodgrod turn one wall and go assassinate Abaddon. Because <laughs> he gives himself plus one to hit and plus one to wound. <laughs> He's just a total beast. It's freaking hilarious to watch. Could just place them here, and then depending on how shooting goes, we either get a four or we get a three. Then John Kilcommon's got a very sweet comment. He says he's a Tau player, boo, but he loves my strats and whatnot, and I'm one of the best teachers. Bro, that's so sweet of you. I really appreciate that. Very kind of you. Super appreciate you being here and hanging out with us on this very fine Friday evening. Let's see. The line writes. Oh, that's a big. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, when I just read your comment, you said scout move, wah, murder, bonder, and a character uh, turn one. I read that as murder boner. And uh, from now on, I'm going to refer to Zodgrod as the murder boner. So uh, there you go. You're welcome for that imagery, everybody. Let's see. The line goes like there. Are That's we, a line. Are we in agreement? Yeah, it looks like a line. Right. I think you have plenty of shots that you can put out right there. So if we then look at this, we can drop them. There. <laughs> move. Right there. Hanging out in San Diego, says Griffin Grinnell. Hey, man, that's cool. We, we, we like San Diego. San Diego is a pretty cool place. Easiest job in the history of the world is to be the weatherman for San Diego. What's the weather like, Lou? Nice. Back to you. Okay, so, these stir so, Shetzel, the question for you, sir. Yes, sir. Did you have to change your plans after my turn at all, or is that basically everything that was expected? Everything was just as expected. I expected Me to lose both dogs. I, I actually expected to lose these two, so in a sense, I am units up. Yep. I expected to struggle a lot more from behind enemy lines, but I do not have to. I would agree. That's That, that was a little surprising to me that they're both still alive as well. It is that 5-up Feel No Pain and the 5-up Invulse. All of those things combined make this army a lot more durable than people uh, think. Yeah, those get, because uh, and everyone might laugh about that because they don't quite get it. But this one, or the one dragoon surviving on one wound, made me have to change the way I coordinated my knob attacks. So then I didn't get to put two knobs into this stalker to guarantee that he died. The alpha can go. Sterilizer. Dude, melee tal is gonna be sick. A crew detachment sounds awesome, actually. <laughs> Straight up. Oh, if you think I'm doing shenanigans now, dude. Oh, oh. a crew detachment that's gonna be freaking great. Let's see, this gentleman can move up like here, making sure that we are, of course, an inch away from the wall. Everyone likes to be an inch away from the wall. Inches matter. Uh, I. Th I think you might want to scoot them just a wee bit more, because if I measure from your gun here, I can get it. Oh, yes. Sir. Nice. Now you're good. Now, let's see. We have a unit. We need to have something within six of. Everyone likes having movements that are uh, within six of them. And then uh, that is assault right there. The alpha doesn't necessarily matter. So everything in your army has a five end bonus, is that right? Everything except for the transports. Okay. Can you imagine if the transports also had stealth and five up involved base? Dude, it's kind of bananas. Right, so we want the rad carbines there and everything else. So ultimately, that doesn't matter because we just want vision and range for. Oh, I hate that they lose the name, these two. Just want vision to Mr. Moss. Vision. Everybody likes vision. We should be there. And then the rest of these gentlemen. 
I'll simply um so what's really fun about this is this unit that's uh, that's dead, this marshal who has, who has the infiltrate, he essentially increases your chance of winning this matchup by like 20% by himself. Oh yeah, like without that unit... If you're not able this, to block my Zod already... Grots right here, then I get to push out all this and you don't get to move block me at all. And exactly. basically you have no chance of winning. I, I essentially nullify Zod. Yeah, which is exceptionally important. And that might be an argument to maybe not bring him. Um, and and my rationality for that mm -hmm. um, is that Space Marine Scouts are super common, and they oh, typically yeah. have three units of them. Oh, yeah. Like, why wouldn't you? If you're playing Space Marines, the, the army should start with three of those. They're unbelievable. Yeah, so, so Zod essentially doesn't work against them. Right. Eldar typically take Rangers now. Oh, yeah. That one unit is such a big deal. Let's see. So I am honestly fine with... Um, let's see. Where can I fit? Can I fit him like right there? Yeah. That'll work. And then the marshal can desperate for like there, I believe. Sure. Let's see. Need to just double check that. Uh, oh, that might actually be kind of hard. Let's just copy him. Just, uh... Yeah, yeah. That seems fine. Oh, yeah, that's easy. Oh, yeah, his base is tiny. That's right. Yeah, yeah, totally fine. Okay. Um, let's desperate. Okay. He's dead. He dies. Poof. He dies that's, somehow. That's an acceptable outcome. Yeah, I mean, that was the correct thing to do, right? Because if you, ha if yeah. you had just left him melee, he dies. So, and, and honestly, then I also pile into this thing and kill it. So it's like... Exactly. So that was 100% the correct thing. Now the question becomes: Do I take a second set of sky stoppers, drop them here, shoot the Gretchen, and start blasting, and then uh, move over here so that I block this avenue? Because then the flash gets still don't necessarily go anywhere, and at most they can shoot at the dragoons, which won't die too much. So essentially, like the way this list looks like, actually, supply drop's probably a bad mission for you. because Technically, yes, because I will yeah. be expending resources heavily. Yeah, because I'm going to probably end up tabling you by round four, but if you have the lead that it looks like you might have, then it doesn't matter. All right, so you haven't ward. No. Which means that you get at most um, six and then... Plus two. That's too far to even declare. Which is fine. Did you measure from my war boss or did you measure from the normal guys? Oh, I didn't yeah. see the war boss. So no, I'm with Win. I'm, I, I can declare. So yeah, that's so going to be a 9 inch for nine. me. Nine. Yeah. Which is acceptable. Mm -hmm. Or it's going to be a, you know, 10 inches and sloppy with these boys. Yeah, of course, of course. Yeah. So I think I continue with my original plan. The original plan! The plan of the ancients. So, just to drop here. Drop it like a tie. And move and block. Is this this is the unit that gets to scoot and shoot? No, that is in vehicle one, I believe. Yes. Okay, vehicle one is scoot and shoot. Yes, sir. I'm gonna make them purple because purple things be tricky. Auras are so much easier for me. Color auras are so much easier for me. Not everyone is blessed, though. Some people are colorblind. I get it. Move him up right there. Mm -hmm. And transport two. Do you have firing deck out of these things? No. Uh -huh. So I need to deploy. I like it. So we want everything on here, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> Midlove, uh, the Grand Strategist, wants to tell us that this setup reminds me of the World of Warcraft episode of South Park for some reason. Listen, my wife brought me beer. She didn't bring me a poop pan. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ah, <laughs> Cheesy bath. We need more bengue. Oh, jeez. Dude, that episode is eternal. The glory that is that episode is is just it's so much glory. Uh, 
And then... And then... Just move the flamers up there. And then... Because ultimately your movement gets you like right there. Then I would need... Uh, we need a 12 from him, if you please. 12! It's uh, a little bit short of 12 because it comes from the center of his base, so it just goes slightly further than that. All right, so if I'm, like, yeah. outside of it, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, if you're just, just outside of it, it'll be good. So, like, this guy's probably fine right here. Yep. I'm just, I just need a little bit of... Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's good. You don't have to move him. Oh, but you're choosing yeah, to. Just... I see how it is. Making room. I'm making the day. Making the day. Excuse me. Move out and get like somewhere around here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They'll die next turn. Within range. But if I move away those three. Do, 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 do. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Let's see, 15. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> The scoot and shoot group. Let's see, do I do anything with them? I don't think so. Let's see. Ba -ba 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 -ba. These two. Pew, 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 pew. So we're going to pump a ton of rerolling hits and rerolling wound shots into Maz right now. Yeah, I'm essentially like doing a little play to see if I can... Like, can you stat check into him? Yeah. That's reasonable. That's... You, and you ignore cover on him too, right? Everything all these here guys? ignores cover, yeah. yes. Dude, I, I hate those armies. Like, everything... This is Votan too, man. Everything ignores cover. There we go... There we go! This. Psh, rotate that. You just drove straight through the wall. Nerd. You, yeah, you actually see. will have to. You actually will have to rotate a good bit here. Yeah, I'm just thinking yeah. if I if I can um, move up normally and then just advance and shoot. But I think the other Dune Rider is in the way. I believe I would have to go like two inches there. Leave it come low. Can, I, can I fit even... No, if we ignore the ramp, is that not part of the model? And no, because that thing's still against stuff. It can close, and it's not like modeled in the collision. Oh, okay, gotcha. So you could you could have it legally modeled without it. Oh yeah. Cool, cool. You you can model it closed. So we'll just assume that's not there then. But I will move up anyways. Cool. cool. And then I don't. Well, Mars is. Paul, so I can just stand here and shoot, can't I? I rather like this idea of running the gets with the knobs inside a truck together. I mean, with your army all having stealth, it's 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 not necessarily that great. But I, I rather enjoy that quite a bit, though. I think. Yeah, they they are useful tools. Let's see, draw a line. Draw this thing keeps. Draw some lines. Draw some lines. And the reason I am taking my time with this is because Jonathan is an opponent that you need to respect your distances. Oh, you're a sweetheart. Thanks, man. Then I need to be outside of this. Outside of means this. That I need. No, I am a little bit outside, so that makes sense. Uh, we might as well uh, chunk everything at you. Chunk, chunk. You you're not going to shoot these. You don't know that. Time. You don't know me. Fair enough. I might. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, these two need to be within 15. There. One marshal with, marshals with this squad and the other marshals with inside here, right? Yeah. So this guy, all right, got it. So these are the two squads that get to reroll hits. Yes, sir. Okay. Yep, 
Yeah, this is cool, man, because you you don't give up. Bring it down, really. I mean, but it's tw- oh, no, oh you totally do because these guys are care. These guys are, aren't they? So you give up a lot, and never mind. That's uh, so that's the other unit of sterilizers. Midlist says that Tal started the army wide no cover thing. We should blame them, bro. I'm totally comfortable blaming Tal for everything. To to be honest with you. Well, from here means that this truck easily could shoot at them and move and such. Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll blast the hell out of you. So I believe we save that squad of sterilizers for later. Oh, my. Then we do our reserves. Reserves! So all of that is fine. And uh, I need a mine here, if you please. So many circles. Concentric circles everywhere. Yep, he can see, so that'll give you the scoop shoot. Yeah, I mean, I can also see the truck. <gasps> Fine, makes sense. Just another layer of move blocking shenanigans things. There we are. Ba, 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 ba. I ba, ba. believe that is everything. Okay, well, I'll just go ahead and take time for a moment, I believe. Because I think Can these bad boys, I believe these boys come in right about here. This seems like the correct spot for them, if I'm not mistaken. That is certainly a thing to do to deny me some points next turn. I believe this is correct. Um, yeah, this looks correct to me. I could also bring them, like, maybe here. Let me assist you. Thanks. And these guys already are going to have a really hard time seeing me. Yeah, because then I can go take your backfield. I think this is probably more correct if I do it like this. Then I just don't really want... If you want to shoot two guys at them, that's kind of okay with me. Oh yeah, I got moved out of the a little further away anyway. So if I'm here, then in my next turn, it's gonna be very simple for me to just move my 12. And that's gonna give me a six inch to take your backfield. Yeah, I think that is comfortable. And then here, none of them should be able to shoot. Yeah, no one can shoot there. This thing can't shoot, can't shoot so I should be able to scoot you a little forwarder. Because this is the furthest distance that you have. Oh, no. That would give him... That would give one guy a shot. And that's just a normal guy with a... Oh, it's anti infantry four up. Three shots. And he does get to reroll hit rolls. I don't really want you to get to reroll hit rolls. So I'll place him here. And that should stop the line of sights. So then we'll rotate like that. Done. And that'll give me just that six-inch charge. I'm comfortable with that. Then, can this guy see him? No. So I'm just going to rotate his spear to make his his fist so that you actually can't see him. I'm not sure, I'm not sure that did it, so I'll just do this to make sure that'll work. All right, I spent my season. All righty. All righty. Let us uh, do shenanigans. Julian, the flash get trucks I think is really interesting. I like it a lot. It's it's yeah, useless in this matchup because the entire army has stealth, but I think it's cool. Yeah, so you're gonna start with them all into the gets. Do they get to reroll wound rolls, right? Yes, sir, because you are on an objective and I'm within six of a battle line unit. Nice. Cool. Then there's no point in being minus one wound. That is twenty-nine. Casual. Five swift rerolls. Yep, yep. Takes eighteen saves, please. Is there AP on that? Uh, no, you're not within any deployment zone, and I did not spend CP. Cool. So then that is going to be one, two, three, four, and all dead. Excellent. So the other option there is I could have not used the gets, and I could have had just had the truck charge, and the truck could have piled in. I think that would probably have been a better idea than using the gets for that last turn. Uh, one save there, and then I'll do my uh, move. Passed. Let's see, Holy Whipping 12. Yeah, so guys, if you were watching the correct decision last turn, instead of putting using the gets to go into these hounds, I should have just charged the truck. 
Because then I, I I knew the the, the hogs were going to kill the raiders. Then the truck could have just piled in, and then I wouldn't have had to worry about losing the gits for no reason. So I just I, that was a ninety five point throw away right there. Don't make that mistake in your games. So I can block up there. That means that they go away. Mm -hmm. They can't go there, so I think I can go six there and block that. But I think it is more important to block that because I have another unit. Block, 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 block. Everybody likes to block. Block, 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 block. Maybe there's a second line there somewhere. And then there's a line like with da. I believe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he was on his side. That's why it looks funky. Gotcha. Cool. We do in the move blockings. Move blocks. Alrighty. Uh, this squad. Let's do the Dune Rider first, of course. Dune Rider. The mm -hmm. Um, the lead eighty. Yes. Mm -hmm. so, so here, I suppose I'll minus one to wound, Mister Mazamaz. There we go. Might as well do it right away. Yep. Yep. Sixes. Ooh, nice. Win late. Oh, jeez. And I believe you are in your deployment zone, so it is AP1, but he does not ignore cover. But I believe I see all of you from that one. Alright, save four of them, and then a four up. Takes one. Do you have a four up in one? Yeah, of course. The mouse rod. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. Um, and, and, who, and who do... shot? That was the Dune Rider. Oh, okay, cool. Then we'll do the squad. Mm -hmm. I am tempted to do the anti infantry four up into the knobs, and cool. I believe I will. Do. And the rest into there. Cool. The Archibus. Mm -hmm. Marshal. Mm -hmm. It uh, would be. Six. six. Mm -hmm. River roll. No. Then uh, the Arc Rifle. Yay! Well, uh, Dev Wounds. Oh, I have River to Wound for. No one. Two dub wounds. All right. Uh, I'll oh, take that. Sorry. Thank you. Take a wound. And then the plasma caliber. It's plasma caliber. Reroll. One wound. One wound. AP four. Save. There we go. Hazardous. He lives. And then it is the eighteen other shots mm -hmm. into the knobs. Yep. Rerolling for Marshall. Mm -hmm. And then only force, no reroll, because they aren't fire supported. AP one. Mm -hmm. Ignore cover. Alright, so that's gonna be five damage, so you kill three. Because one is wounded. Okay. Very good. Um I will do uh, uh, uh. let's do this vehicle into mm -hmm. Mars Rock. He's gonna go all pew 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 pew. Hail of fire, let's go. Doop. And then sixes, twin links. Three saves, save you one. But you do have cover, so it'll be on force. Uh, threes? Uh, it's, it's always false, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. Maybe one because you're in the deployment zone. Yeah, so a three up. Because I have a yeah. three of armor save. Ah, he's a three up. Yeah. Right. Alright, takes a wind. Cool, cool. Uh, uh Nikolai, just... yeah, you can still join. Oh. Just hop in the Discord and uh, make sure you're in the members only side and send me a PM. I'll give you an access code to the tournament. I'll do the uh, 18. Mm -hmm. There is no marshal. Okay. And then sixes with rerolls. Two. Two saves. AP1 and... ignores cover. He's ignored. Okay. So threes. Oh, AP1 through so fours. Past one and a roll. All right. Takes another wound. No, sir. That's not, making, not making many field pains here. Arquebus. Miss. Nope. The Arc Rifle. Miss, miss. The Plasma Caliber. Miss, miss. Yeah, that's Admech without the Marshal. Yep. Hazardous. He's good We're to go. Good. Do this vehicle. Mm hmm. Doop, doop, doop. Just a volume of shots. And a five that shouldn't be there. Sixes, we have twin links. 
Three saves. Three saves, sir. Three ups, and then four ups. Just takes the damage. Slowly but surely. Let's do the. This is a Marshall squad. Mm -hmm. Marshall. Sixes. Fire sword. Two at one. Ignore cover. Uh, AP one, you said. AP one, yes. All right. Because you are in Save the both. Excellent. Let's do the two pistols. Marshall. And he's within 12 for a pistol? Oh, yeah, of course he is. Yeah, yeah. That's the squad inside. Uh, no, no wounds. Then the Archibus. Archibus hits. No wound. Green room. That's a wound. One wound. AB3. Save. The Arc Rifle. One hit so far. Marshall. One hit. That's a wound. Death wounds. Oh, dev wounds. Oops, sorry. Uh, so I'll pass my first wounds. one and then pass the second one. Okay. Yes, sir. And then the plasma caliber. Plasma caliber! Both hit. One wound so one far. Wound. Fire support. All right. Four up. And two damage. Two damage. Pass it both. D. As it is. Nope, you're good. Oh, cool. So um, many shots. Let's see. Let's Dude, there's so many weapon profiles, you're right. <laughs> These could put a lot of shots down range there. Would have sixes on either unit. Yep, yep. So since they're gone, I am just. I think I homer with that Dune Rider. Okay. And then I prepare these for a charge because I think you are in the killable range. Yeah, definitely. Because I am plus one to wounds, so I'll be wounding on five, six, five, yeah. and so forth. So. Yeah, that's, that, that's killable. Yeah. Let's use the sterilizers now. Mm -hmm. Nine. Right. 29 shots. 29. Sixes. Five, AP one, ignore cover. All right. Take one. Yes, sir. Then we shoot the Vanguard squad. Mm -hmm. The uh, plasma caliber. So that's a plasma and a. Plasma. Is that it? Yeah, plasma dies. It's it's only the special weapon. Oh, okay, gotcha. Plasma dies. Do hazardous. Uh, arc rifle. Ah, that's him right there. Okay. Nope. No wound. And the arquebus. Nope. There we are. They were the uh, backup for them in the off chance that you actually lived. Makes sense to me. Um, good, 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 fair good. Uh, let's do the phosphorus and penta into the knobs, I believe. Three shots. Yes, Some sir. Fours. Oh, I'll hit. Ooh. Should be uh, five. One, so one, AP three, I believe. Because it's AP two regularly. No, AP one regularly. So AP two. All right, so then I'll, cover. I'll have a six up. And I fail. It's two damage. Yes, sir. Kills that man. So only a war boss on its own. Yep, pretty killable. Deal with him later. Pretty killable. Here we go. Oh, I am not scared of him dying because he can't die to a heroic if you do that. Because the heroic strat says you have to move towards the thing you declared the charge on. This is accurate, sir. I think... We are good with this. Captain on his own can get overwatched or whatever when he moves. Because mm -hmm. uh, whatever comes out of here will go over here and then in. So we are fine with the current state of the battlefield. Cool. Let's do... I haven't forgotten anything, have I? That's correct. Do a charge. We're going to do it. Oh, they made it. Face. Actually, with a 10. Yeah. Can I maximize this? No, I yeah. can't get holy with him. Why not? I can't get holy with him with all three. Oh. 
You don't think so? Because you could. Oh no, okay, yeah, because you'd have to be within. Uh, you'd end up within range of them. Yeah, that's yeah. fair. That's true. We got a base attack there. There. Mm -hmm. uh, try to not touch the objective to give you a free overwhelming if you get that. Makes sense. Then... Mm, no, he can't. How, how does an inch look on him? Way too close, right there. So I can go like a da, and like right da. That looks correct. Uh, still within right there, actually. Um, but you can scoot him forward a little and make it work. Is it like da? Yeah, that worked. Cool. Okay, and then you're good there. So I think do I? I think I'm probably just going to go ahead and two CP charge you back. Yes, with my hogs, I think it's probably correct here. Yeah, so let's do that. Because I think Moz dies regardless. So the hogs, they <laughs> roll a three. Okay. That should be enough to get all of them in with the bases. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they'll all fight. Yeah, so if Mothrog takes the firepower of an entire army, probably should die, but not against Admech, because Admech only just just enough. Keep in mind, you have to move closer to the target you declared heroic on. Mm, this is uh, very accurate. Uh, you're not wrong. Mm. Oh, and uh, before we forget, these guys obviously scooting back into their vehicle. Oh yeah, go ahead with that. That's cool. Because this is a situation where we declared that intent beforehand. 100%. And that's what playing by intent is about. Can it is like about within? talking and yeah, finding closer. plausible solutions. Could I get him on the pylon up there? I could technically get him on the pylon up there, but that would take me out of coherency, so it's not going to work. So we'll just bring him like this. Okay. Charge is complete. Your yes, turn, sir. Let's uh, see if we can get him. Choop. There we go. Sustained two. Winning a force. It's typically always nines with this. Or force. AP two. Oh, he's gonna live. And that's two damage, so four ups. Takes a wound. Yes, sir. Okay, well that was nice. That's a nice little bonus. Um okay, cool. So let's go ahead and have we'll hit with Moz first. He's yep, got six attacks. It makes sense to me. He's got six attacks, he will slap you on twos. Uh one explosion, one miss. Or two misses, one explosion. Wounds you on fours. Just one save. AP one damage four. Yes, sir. Good. That's good. And then big chop up. Uh, full house. And then because uh, one explosion. And then when you're on fours, two saves. AP two damage five. Okay, ten damage. Can maximally kill one though. Yes. Two. And it kills one. Does he blow? Let's see who do we blow. Who do we take? Who makes most sense? Uh, I believe this one. Yes. Ooh, maybe I fucked up. I think I did fuck up. Oh no, I barely got it right there, I think. Am I on? You are not in base, sadly. I really fucked that up then. That was a disaster. A disastrous decision for me. Oh well. Should have one hundred percent started with these guys. So, guys, what happened there was I did not start with squig hogs because yeah. I was fucking stupid. Yeah, basically. Uh... One that that is a consequence of becoming like too eager. Yeah, exactly. That was me. I got excited and I am now getting punished, and I probably won't kill these guys now. Like even even if even if things go the way you want to, you need to not. Um, overreact to yeah. it because like okay I caught a windbreak that's excellent but I like Jonathan obviously knew before he did this like when he did mm -hmm. this that he should start with these yeah it was a really but foolish then decision I just a made. good thing happened with Moz so his mind is is like Moz like in his mind it's just Moz 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 mm -hmm. And so what I just did there is I potentially throw the game by doing that. Because if I had killed all these right now, then in my turn I get to eat everything for free. But now I yep. probably won't kill them, and that can 100% just throw the entire game for me. So that is an excitement overreaction that you should not have in your games. So let's roll my attacks. I'll have uh, four guys. Yes, sir. Uh, so that's going to be 12 attacks. 
hit me on twos, one hiss, one explosion, uh, fours. Yeah, so there's no way I kill these guys now. So that's going to be five saves, AP1 damage too. Five saves, AP1. Right, so that's just four damage, and then I'll go ahead and roll the uh, hogs. Yeah. Eight, two. And, oh my gosh, and that's a huge whiff on the hits. Only uh, four hits and one explosion, and then fives here, and no more wounds with the hogs. Yeah, so that was a big old fat error. Okay, cool. So that is going to be the end of your turn. You will score um, behind for three. Yep, three for each. Mm -hmm. And then if you turn it on over my turn. You, gentlemen. So I'll get nothing for primary, and I'll draw some cards. I get area denial and behind. So area denial is impossible. Behind is not impossible. Let's see if my Gretchen get me CP. Behind is essentially guaranteed. Yep. And then because your Grotz didn't give you CP this turn, mm -hmm. you don't overload on two, but you will get one at the end because area denial will be difficult. Yeah, well, not even difficult. It just like straight up can't happen. Um, okay, so then uh, let's go ahead and move. Zodgard Wart Snyder. Mm -hmm. Oh, my Gretchen. Mm -hmm. We'll pop this bad boy up, roll him on over here, and we'll get a good six inch with that little runt herd. This Gretchen can come here. This Gretchen can come here. Then I will. Let's see. This truck will move three inches, and then I'll move nine inches afterwards. Would you like to overwatch me? No, sir. Okay. And then... These knobs will move six inches. That's a little annoying. You don't have a fallback and shoot, do you? Uh, no, but the, the dragoons always fall back and charge. Okay. So these guys can all just come here. Then, war boss. Let's put him. I think we'll go ahead and put him up here. Would you like to overwatch him? Mm, I think not. Okay. And then that was probably the correct decision. I think we'll take this truck full of snagas. And... There are a couple of options that I want to um, potentially save that command point for. That makes sense. Another Fiona pain, maybe? It, it is the Fiona pain, potentially, on, for example, the sterilizers. Mm -hmm. uh, or it is loan upping the vanguards, or it is the threat of the overwatch on the flash kits. Yeah, because the, fla the flash kits are definitely coming out to play, because they kind of have to. So I think we're going to just kind of shift my Gretchen here a little bit. They're kind of in the way. Let's do it this. Uh, would you mind me rolling me in advance, please? Yes, sir. A three. A three, so I get nine inches with these guys. I'm going to bring them like this. And then I'm going to track, just backtrack a few of these guys like this. This. You can come back to here. Come here. Um, then, yeah, we'll actually put these guys out like this, I believe. Then you can be here. Okay. Then I'm going to probably have all of my these things get out and they'll just put a stand right here 
uh, something like this. Okay. Then this truck. What do you do? I think you. Um. So I can't get the flash kits out of this truck, actually, can I? So you're too close to me, so there's no way I can disembark. Can, but there's it's it's a difficult disembark that keeps you like a little bit behind. Yeah, so let let me see if I can actually do this. If I can, then I'm gonna then I'm gonna do it, and if not, then I won't. You can let also me... move it and disembark. Yes, 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 yes. I I would like to disembark and then move them though. Of course, for the charge. Yeah, exactly. Because I want to send them in to go kill your sterilizers. <laughs> I will help you with the Perfect. one. Mm -hmm. so I these... did not intend for any blocks for what it's worth. And then these guys can, can fit here because of the truck. I just don't want to move the truck yet yep. to make sure that this works, right? Yeah, and then he can stand there. Basically, then you could. Could... Okay, cool. So I can do it. So I think I will do that then. Okay, so then this truck... In that case, we'll advance. Okay, so it's going to go uh, 16. Okay. And then I'll pull, pl place all my gets down. Give Monsieur Badrock his time in the sun. Hey, Eddie's in the chat. What's Eddie saying? Tell Eddie I love him. If you guys don't know Mr. Eddie, Mr. Edgar is a member of 2D6, which is the largest miniature gaming club in the world officially. Uh, there could be a larger store-owned store, store -owned gaming club that we don't know about. Or perhaps one in the far, far east that no one talks about. But uh, as far as we can tell, we are the largest. And, it, and by the looks of what he posted in Off Topic on the Happy Crumble Discord server. People are jealous. Very, very <laughs> good carpenter. Yeah, dude. That guy rocks. He has finished the uh, 2D6 uh, uh, project he was working on. Ooh, that's really exciting. Would you like to ever watch me now? Um, question is, how many can see? Not many. I'm not going to give you that many. And is the penal pain more worth it? The feel of pain and the loan up. I would say the field of pain is probably a better bet, but I don't know that. If that makes sense? It certainly feels like it, because right now I think there's like... You're going to get like two, maybe three guys, right? Let's see. It's, it's the wings that... Maybe like four. Perhaps four. Okay, fair enough. And like how many is four versus the field of pain? It's like, oh, I don't want to do that math in my head. So I want to say that I don't want to overwatch. Okay, fair enough. And then that works. So then let's go. Oh, and I need to move these boys. Now the question with these guys, these Dune Riders have how much OC? Two, Mr. Jonathan. Two. So I could just pop them right there, deny you that for your coming turn. Put you on just a five, which is probably more worth it than gambling on this big charge here. If um, you were to advance these, though, you would get three on behind enemy lines. Oh, I drew behind enemy lines, didn't I? Crap. That's true. Yeah, that's true. I do need to kind of do that, don't I? Um, I mean, I I will allow you to not. Yeah. It, it is it is essentially if 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 we if we think about this as like mm -hmm. an example of what you do, right? It is a three points to you. Versus five points to me. That's a two point differential. Yeah, but However, I think I'm gonna take this off you with my grots anyway. 
So I'm not it's potentially right if yeah. you make that charge. But it is it is It's a five inch, so I think yeah, it's worth it. You you still need to make it. That's true. Okay. I think I'm gonna so, go for so it. It is it is a guaranteed three to you mm -hmm. or a guaranteed five to nine. Mm -hmm. So it's either it's either two in your favor. Mm -hmm. Or two against you. Right. I think With I'm just gonna go for gamble it. Gamble on the five as a guarantee for the for it. I'm just gonna go for Whereas it. So I better roll my advance. Gamble, right? Mm -hmm. you, you can swing eight in your favor. So I move sixteen. And then I can still charge after this, but I just take some mortals. Would you like to overwatch me? No, sir. Okie dokie. Um so now behind me lines is locked in at least a little bit there. Then I think that's going to be all of my movements. Just move this truck up a wee bit like this. Maybe I can move him like this. Yeah, we'll do it like that, actually. Cool. And that works basically completely. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and uh, would you like to wrap the ingress? Um... That's a very good question. I couldn't overwatch if I do it. I can do it for extra OC, but you are OC2. Mm -hmm. um, I can do it to put myself here so that there's a chance that you could, would have to pile into me if you wanted to pile. Mm -hmm. Which means that I get to fight back. Mm -hmm. um, but you are minus one to wound mm -hmm. or something. I remind them of the rules again here. They're plus one to hit and minus one to wound. And plus one to wound. <laughs> yeah, so weird. I would be wounding them on uh, force mm -hmm. with 20 ish attacks. Um, probably not wipe them. I would be tagged next turn. Mm -hmm. It would be better for me to drop and flame something. Uh, yeah, yeah. That's kind of a tough decision, right? I still believe the feel no pain here is the optimal play. Feel no pain seems like a reasonable one to me. It doesn't seem like a bad choice. Feel no pain or the loan up here? Yeah, the loan up does seem like a good choice, because I'll wipe all that Vanguard with his gets right now. Because they re-roll. Yes, sir. Okay, cool. So, um, you saying no? I will not wrap it in grass. Okay, okay. So then let us proceed to the shooting phase. So I'll go ahead and shoot this truck at your loan, Stracky Sterilizer. Yes, sir. Hits you all on sixes because you're stealth. All missed. And then I'll shoot all these pistols at them, except for the ones that obviously are out of range. Okay. So I'm just missing probably those four. So that is going to give me six pistol shots. Two hits. Your toughness is three or four? Uh, on those it is four. Okay, fours, no wounds. And then we have the beast boss. He hits you on fives. All missed. Then we'll shoot my... All of my Gretchen will shoot him. I think all of them, right? No, nah, maybe not all of them. So then do two just like this. So like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. Yes, sir. Hit you on fours and plus one hit you. Yeah. All right. And then four fives. Or fours because I'm plus one to wound you. So that's going to be three wounds, no AP. Oh, save them all. Good. Then we got a slug, two sluggers, basically, because one for both of those miss. All right. Then I'm going to shoot Mr. Maz into your Skitari Vanguard. It's going to be yes, D3 sir. shots. So four shots because I'm splashed. Then we'll hit you on sixes. One hit. We'll wound you on a two. That's a wound. No AP. Two damage. I'm good. Cool. Then I will shoot... This one solo truck, this solo truck, will shoot at your, doesn't actually really matter, so nothing really matters. I'm not even going to bother with that one. So then we're on to the gets. I believe I'm going to shoot the gets at your dragoons. Yeah, I'll shoot them all at the Dragoons, and I'll put two into this Die Stalker. That gives me some decisions to make. I thought it might. 
So you're lethals and exploding. It's a lot of damage, but as long as one lives, mm -hmm. you're locked there. You're no longer a threat to these. So the field of pain certainly makes a lot of sense there. It does. So I believe we will do that. Okay, okay. So I got two guys going to the one die stalker. So that's going to be eight shots for those two. They're going to hit you on sixes uh, to reroll everything. All right, that's going to be, f and of course, lethal as well. So that's going to be four hits. Uh, oh, is the lethal something you pop? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, a once per, it's once per game pop, yeah. Yeah, and you're using it now. Yeah, absolutely. And then these will wound you on twos. That's going to be four saves at AP one damage two on that one to Shiraki. Because I am within the minus one aura range, right? Yeah. Oh, actually, you're out. So take that one too. So just three of them. Sorry, I'm, I messed up. I didn't. I, yeah, didn't. I just assumed. Uh, Two damage. He died. That? Poof, poof. Okay, and then oh. everyone else is blasting into those dragoons. So we're gonna have uh, minus eight. So that'll be. She's a bunch of shots. So thirty-two. They will be. Hit. Or you know, I'm gonna shoot uh, Bad Rocks first. He's got three shots and he's overcharging. Oh, one guy's on four wounds. Oh, five okay. wounds. Yeah, so we'll we'll do him first. Okay, re-rolling. All missed. Does he take damage? I'll just roll it right now. First hit. He does not. And then we have the rest of them shooting. Stealth is a hell of a thing, man. Well, to be fair, you would have been minus one there anyway. Oh, no, I know. that, But that's why I chose this one, because everyone else is already stealth. Makes sense. That was a pretty good wound roll. All right, so you're going to have 15 AP1. 15. Do I have cover? You do. All right, so threes. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Two damage each. Two damage each. And I'll do them in twos. Mm -hmm. So two one, two, three, dead. five dies. One, two, three. Survives four, on five, one six. move. Lives on one. Mm -hmm. All we need. Oh, do I explode? That's a big one. That's actually a very big one right now. No, you do, I do not. Okay. Uh, then I will go ahead and shoot. Oh fuck, because I can't grenade that guy. Ugh, so frustrating. That would be the beautifulest time to grenades. Indeed. Well, that kind of cancels out my plans there. Um. There we go. Mm -hmm. Add Mac the just enough army. The just enough army. Okie dokie. Uh. I do have a little shooting just with War Boss. We'll shoot his Dev Wound thing into your Vanguard. He's got a twin. Uh, he's got a combi weapon. Yes, sir. Two shots, hit you on sixes, no hits. And I think that's all I need to bother with. So let's do a charge phase. Uh, War Boss is going to go on into your Skitari, I believe. Would you like to do anything about that? No, sir. I have no more CV. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I'm uh, always floating on one, unless there's like a couple of movement phases and stuff where I don't do anything. You know, I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna wait on that war boss. I'm gonna send the gets on into your sterilizers. That's a six inch. Yes, sir. Because you, that's where you need that CP. I'll take that six. Now, is that is, is that enough to wipe them? If we're probably. thinking theoretically, probably not. So I probably need, will need to send the war boss in. Hmm. And that is why we waited. Mm -hmm. Exactly. You can just stand right here. I've seen no gun in the wall. Bad rock can come here. That'll be plenty. These guys will all get in. They'll be able to get in. Uh, oh, because they're going to pile into that fucker, aren't they? Yes, sir. Okay, well, that means the war boss probably has to go and kill him first. Or actually, I could, or the beast bosses, but I really don't want to expose them because they'll get lit the hell up. Oh, actually, this truck can still try to go to it as well. And the rest of these won't make it into combat anyway, so I'll bring them over here. Okay, this can do do should be like that. And you could be like that. Here. Okay, I'll go and roll that truck on into the Dragoon. 
Yes, sir. That's a six. That's a fail. That's certainly not a thing to reroll. Um, these knobs are just going to have to eat your uh, sky stalkers. They'll take the seven. Should be enough to potentially pile afterwards. No, nah, I don't think so. Oh, actually, no, yes. Doesn't. Yes, I think so. Yeah. Oh, I was thinking into the sterilizers. If yeah. An objective. Nah, it's just the truck that's going to have to do that. Fair enough. But this will at least get the touch that unit, so that unit will at least have to fall back. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I moved the warboss a little farther, so he'll have to be here for currency. Okay. Um, that'll work. Then let's go ahead and roll. I, I'm going to charge the storm boys, so let's see how many mortal wounds I take. Just one. I'll just put that on the knob. And, uh, then this truck is going to charge your sterilizers. Of course it will. Gonna be a good seven. Seems fair. Oop, so we'll just like that. And then we'll have to any other charges. Then it's the war boss. Oh and and the uh obviously of course our grotch grotchen grotch Um they can guarantee more or less guarantee this charge. Well actually that is technically that is absolutely a guarantee charge. And if I get enough, then I can pile in over here. I think I'd rather go for that 5-inch on them, though. I'm going to go for the 5-inch. Let's go. Boop. With a 4. And I get one CP reroll. Um, I guess you might want to unbridle Carnage somewhere. Yeah, I really might. Um, yeah. Because there's no way I take this off, objective off of you. I think I really want to put you on that five, though. Where do I need the Umbrado Carnage? Wiping this would basically be what I need it for. Um, we're wiping this back here. I really should roll that charge after I roll to see how many died first. Um, I th think I'm going to go ahead and uh, just let that one be, because I don't need that. That's just that's a nice thing to deny you points, but I don't need it. Okay, so then we will just go ahead and send the war boss into the dragoon. That's a two incher. I don't can't really fail, so I'll just do that. Make sure he didn't, he rolled more than three. Yeah, he rolled an eleven. Yeah, you didn't want to. Yeah. Go into the into the sterilizers anymore. No, I think I need to kill this so I can pile them into the sterilizers. I think that's more fair. Important. Fair. Because I really don't want my beast nagus to like just die next turn. From because you're gonna have you're gonna have tons of anti infantry shooting coming this way. Makes sense. Uh, okay, and then I've got the two inch charge of the storm boys, and they make a nine, which is pretty good. Now, for people thinking this might look bad for Jonathan scoring wise, it is most certainly not. It's and actually pretty okay. That, the reason for that is because it is supply drop. Mm hmm. You can score, um, you can essentially end up with a differential of 30 points in, in turn 5. Mm -hmm. So if he managed to stop me from scoring 15 in turn 5, and then scores 15 himself, that's a 30 point swing in his oh. favor. And don't worry, Michael. Very, very soon, we will be doing the, uh, we'll be doing the wa. So first things first, the war boss has to fight. Um, so right. he has four attacks, and he will hit you on threes. I'm going to save one in case I have to CP reroll this. Three attacks. Okay, that's one hit. I'll go through the wound roll first, and it doesn't wound. Okay, I get one more attack. That's a hit. And that's a wound. AP2 damage too. Let's go. Cool, that's two damage. It kills him. Does he blow? He does not. Nah. So that's what I really needed. Um, it doesn't really matter, but I'm just going to go ahead and bring him up anyway, I suppose. And then we'll go and pile our kits in. Okay. So let's just touch him here instead. Yep. 
you come here. There. It's really not that many that get to fight. But it's okay, I think. All right, and then we'll go ahead and hit. That's going to be one, two, three, four, five, and bad rock. So five of them. Um, I'm actually I'm one of you on threes here anyway, even though you're T three. Yes, so that's going to be five times four is twenty five attacks, right? No, five times four is tw five times five is twenty five attacks. And yes, I think no, I think I'm going to unbrow charge up there. So we'll just hit you on threes. Okay, that's going to give me three explosions. Pew pew! And then we'll wound you on threes. Come on, give me my attack. Alright, so that's going to be 13 AP1 damage one. Oh, oh. Nerd uh, team, baby. Roll dice, please. One, yeah. two, three, AP4. four. AP1, was it? Yep. Seven, which is three and a half. Uh, they have a three power save? You oh, deleted two fours. One, right? Yeah, AP1, oh, sir. So, a little, little uh, four and a half. Mm -hmm. And then Bad Rock hits. He's got six attacks. He'll hit you on twos. Two. Dropped one. And then he'll wound you on threes as well. So, that's going to be four more AP1. Four more AP1. Mm -hmm. Two more damage. Uh, Close one more and one more takes a wound. Yes, sir. And then. This guy. Yay, that guy. Cool. Then we'll go ahead and do here. And do you want to know the best part about behind enemy lines? What's that, sir? There is no battle shocked rider for it. Is there not? There isn't. I was so surprised when I found out. Oh jeez. And yeah. when I saw that, I got even more surprised. Like, oh, that's pretty sick, dude. Oh, uh, we'll have the army of LD7. Yeah, dude, that's pretty badass. I'm gonna have the knob slap you. Yes, sir. So it's gonna be uh, four, five, five times three is fifteen attacks. They'll hit you on threes. Pew! Dropped one, and then these will wound you on twos. All right, that's gonna be thirteen saves, AP two damage two. Let's see ya. Saved. Ah, right, the squad. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. This guy can end an engagement range, so he will. Boop. 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 And boop. Okay. And then my truck's punches. He's got three attacks. Uh, hits with one, wounds on a three. That's one wound, no AP. Should have done the Wrecking Ball first. One wound. You can't do the Wrecking Ball first. That's true, because extra attacks take a wound. And then the Wrecking Ball gets two hits. And wounds on twos, two wounds, no AP on those. Alright, D6 damage each. So the first one dies. Nice. And the second one takes a wound. <laughs> Wrecking Balls, Damn. baby. And then we'll do the Storm Boys. And I think I will... I actually don't even really need to kill all these guys. Uh, Killing them gains you nope, so a, I dead, won't a dead carnage. unit. Yeah, so I won't unbridle carnage there. So I've got four guys with choppas. That is going to be 12 attacks. Uh, you know, we'll do the power claw first, actually. That's probably smarter. He's got three attacks. He'll hit you on fours. There are no extra wounds or anything here. For oh, are there not? Uh, we'll no, it's, all, it's all damage. All right, these are wound on twos. Alright, two saves, AP2 damage two. Fives. Two die. Two die. And then the rest of them will be going in. Hitting on threes! Oh my gosh, that's a bad hit roll. Wow, that's a lot of ones. And then winning on threes. And then just one more save at AP1. Oh, okay. That was, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay. I'm that was, uh, I'm, I'm really glad I didn't spend a CP there, actually. <laughs> Fair enough. And we'll just do like this. Let me do like here. Oh, I guess we'll be like here for coherencies. And then you'll just stay still. Okay. Um, 
Oh no, actually you won't. You'll come like here. And then you'll come like right here. Just, you know, maybe one dies when you do your thing. Just little mercies. Cool. Uh, get shot. They all fought. I think that's everything, right? Makes then sense. you could just slap back. Alrighty. Uh, that'll be eight attacks over here. Eight attacks. And fours. And fives. Mm -hmm. One wound, please. If you're nothing. And that was into the gits. That's into the gits. Safe. And then we can do... Pylons! Uh, we can do it like that. Yay, pylons! Guys, by the way, thanks so much for hanging out with us tonight. There's 26 of you still in chat. That's pretty freaking awesome that you're all hanging out and enjoying your Friday night here. That's a lot for a uh, relatively unknown, like, unannounced, like, no super big name. What are you talking about? We got Mr. Chateau Lignes over here, baby. Fair enough. So it's super cool that you guys are all hanging out. You know, I'm really, I'm really excited to to do what I can to make Warhammer more more popular in the public's eyes. Like it is a very good tactical day game, and and people just don't quite realize it. So we're trying to trying to make it more a little more popular out there. And one of the ways we're doing that is with this half a cup of war game of TTS format. So we hope to see you all of you in there. One wound. One save on the storm boys, Mr. Cool. Jonathan. And failed, so that knob dies because he was already wounded. I had forgotten to put the wound on him, but he was he was wounded for the charge thing. Yes, sir. Um, is there anything else? Oh, yeah, over here. Oh, yeah. Get your pile lens, baby. Uh, mm -hmm. it needs to be closer to the one he was already close to. You can't move. Th oh, yeah, you can move through your model. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, yeah. That's right, yeah. So I can go like right there. Mm -hmm. And obviously, this they won't do anything. Nah, they're not going to hurt me. You, but... you are OC0. Mm hmm. Um, which means that if I can pile three dudes from the other squad mm -hmm. into the objective, then uh, you get a lot of a lot of points. May maybe I can get points. I think it is unrealistic, though. See, he needs to be like seems points. a little challenging, but you might you might get it. You might you might get yeah. it. So one, two, three, four, and five regular and the alpha. <laughs> so. Uh... <laughs> Michael says, uh, or sorry, Will, he says at 3.40 in Texas, any work that comes in afternoon on a Friday is Monday work. Bro, that was the most Norwegian sounding thing I've ever heard you say as an American. <laughs> that, that is an IT thing. Oh, is that in, an IT in thing? Russia. Okay. Oh, 100%. IT. <laughs> That's hilarious. Because if you do something and it doesn't work, then you need to do overtime to fix what you did. Uh -huh. Because if it's, if it's not critical... You don't actually need to do it now. It would be nice to do it now, but if it can fuck something up, everyone has overtime. And you That's something over funny, time. dude. Uh, one save on the knobs so far, Mr. Ujong. Save. And then two from the Alpha, I believe, mm -hmm. unless the Vanguard Alpha has more attacks. Ooh, he hits. Does no. good. As expected. Basically, right? Okay. Let me go over here. Get a so sweet, how, sweet three answer. How tricksy can we be, Mr. Jonathan? Yeah. So he can't do three there. So he can do three mm -hmm. there. And then he can't face, obviously, so we can do three there. So he'll get on the objective. These two will get on the objective, no. probably. Uh, yeah, that guy will probably. Yeah, that's true. Yep, that makes sense. Then we can stop the base here. And by the way, guys, for the tournament, we actually do plan a clock. We're not, we're off, not planning a clock right now because we're talking to you guys and we're having a lovely old time. But for the tournament, there will be a three hour clock. So you'll have to pass it uh, back and forth while you're doing your actions and stuff. So he can't base anything. So we are free for the others. So he goes free. Mm -hmm. And then I don't believe that there are anyone else that could. No, but you'll still deny it to me. Because I'm the only OC2. Oh yeah, of course, but like yeah, yeah. I, it won't do anything for your secondaries right now. No, no, no. Oh, actually, we might need to check that last guy there. Oh, because it's measuring from the middle of the base. Here, I'll ch I'll check it from here. Uh, from the very edge. 
It, it yeah, is he'll, very he'll be good. tricksy. It is very tricksy. You'll have to block yourself works. a bunch, but I think you'll be good. Yeah, I need to, I need to do shenanigans. Because mm -hmm. he needs to go first and then block that so that none of these can get in yep, yep. while also being on. It, it's very tricksy. We'll you don't need happens. to demonstrate it right now, because but we'll, we'll just say it's good. Yeah. But go and roll uh, your tags. Do... Mm -hmm. uh, and then, whoop, fives, I believe. Oh, three saves, anyways. Why would it be fives? Do you have strength five on these guys? Oh, right, the strength four, yeah. yeah. I was just cool. thinking five for some reason. Yeah. Right, mm -hmm. and then... Oh, this truck needs to go. All right, he does. This guy can go here. Mm -hmm. That's on the objective. Mm -hmm. Then this guy can't fit. Mm -hmm. So, moving there should be good. No. Doesn't look like it's passing yet, but you have point one left. Oh no, it is. Yeah, yeah, you got it. You got it. So you're good. Yeah. Now the problem now is. Oh, because you can't get closer if you move this way. Exactly. Yeah. So he might not. Um, two point six there. Mm -hmm. and then. Definitely can't make it over the other guys. Because there's no way. Nah, you're moving further away right? if you do that. Because if you go here, just to demonstrate, it's two point seven. Yeah. That's point one away from it, so that doesn't work. Sadly. But it was close. It was with a great a 40 idea. Millimeter, with a 40 millimeter base, those things are difficult. It was a great idea. And there are yeah, times because... when that will may save a game for you. So Exactly. Yeah, so, so the thing is, right, they would have become OC0. Oh, yeah. Uh, maybe I could have done like shenanigans with like piling and then maybe trying to get that in within three or having vanguards more available mm -hmm. and so forth. Okay. Just let me know if I explain too much and take too much time, by the way. Well, you, you're very thorough, and it's good. It's good. Since we are doing a teaching stream, then we can bring some value. All right, so I think that's the end of the turn. So I do score three on behind, is. and I do discard Eridana for CP. Yes, sir. And then I will. So everybody, uh, now's the time to cover your ears. Yep. So oh, yeah. uh, I will... Uh... I am ready. All right. So, uh, Mr. Michael Ford, this is for you. You you lovely man. Three, two. <sighs> Whoa! Really? <laughs> yes. Did I blow the, the, the microphone out? No, I, I didn't hear it at all. All I heard was, what? Nerd. I literally, I literally heard the weakest war ever. <laughs> it, was just, it was literally just, what? <laughs> this guy took his headphones off. He couldn't handle it. All right, going into round three. No, Shuttle... no, like, like, like I said, Discord nuked it. Oh, right, right, right. Going into round three, Shuttle will score a 10 on his primary again. Oh, right. I forgot to do it for 10. Yeah, I, I, I fixed it, sir. I fixed you yes. up. All right, so um, we like looking at the differential now, right? Mm -hmm. I am 24 points ahead. Mm -hmm. That is more than doable for you oh, yeah. to, to get back. We can absolutely pick that up, but let's let's start picking the pace up a little bit. This is coming on on three three yes, hours sir. now. There we go. You wah -wah. I wah wah. Metal trucks, so four. I'm just gonna desperate them. Uh, I don't think there's anything else that needs battle truck. Okay. Did and you do that? Two, which is fine. Because as you said, it doesn't count for behind enemy lines, and that's really cool. I did not know that. That makes behind enemy lines a lot better. You could just do. Can I go there? Yeah. And let's do like that. That that's more in the way for those. Okay. So I think though I I do actually think I probably overwatch that to deny you those secondaries. Fair enough. Um, which is super annoying. But I... um, is there a way to stand that makes that more annoying, like there? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, it does, doesn't it? That actually makes it a lot more annoying. Yeah, because then only like two can shoot. Uh, yeah, and I, I'm comfortable with you going back and fixing that, so, yeah, never mind, I won't do it. Yeah, makes sense. I think, say, getting those three is more, is better. When you, when you had landed him here, I 100% was doing it, but... When you, oh, when yeah, you, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. If you... But by the way, guys, that's something that you let people, ch you can let people change, like, that's, that's not that big a deal, like, that's yeah, just the intelligent move to do. It, doing it the other I, way I just way asked him to play faster, and so he did a dumb thing because he started playing a little faster. That's not his fault. That's because I asked him to play a little faster, right? Like, <laughs> so you let people fix that. 
Right, let's see. Um, these gentlemen, mm -hmm. what do we do with them? These jet officers. We put them into the transport. They're gonna hop into the transport. Yep. Let's let's do it fast mode. Top, top. That was transport four, I believe. Yes. Transport four, Scorpius Dune Rider. Sir, uh, are you within one of these? Oh yes. yes. Do a fallback. Do oh, I actually, don't think you can fall back. Can you fall back into a unit that's engaged in close combat? Yeah, just three within three of a vehicle. Oh, I didn't think you could do it with something that was engaged. I thought there was flaws on that. Ah. In, in that three. case, please double check. And I'm, I'm just going to double check that one real fast while you do the rest of your turn. Just leave them off right now. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. And we'll go ahead Let's and. See, this one I won't be able to score next turn. So I should focus on maximizing. Move uh, this away. I got another beer. It's very exciting. Oh, I got water. That's way less exciting. Yes. If she gave you yellow water, Jonathan, I would be concerned. I did say thank you. It's very exciting, and you're amazing. All right. Uh, units. Of, oh, that's the wrong order. Come on, transports. Where are you, transports? Thank you, dear. You're welcome. All right, and bark. Feed. Do, 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 do. Um, is he showing us? Oh, I've shown it to him. Oh, okay. Oh, I guess there's no clause on that. Was that a ninth edition thing? No, that wasn't a ninth. Where? Maybe I just made that one up in my brain. I don't. I don't think that was a thing ever. Yeah, I think I probably just made that up in my brain. Was that a was that a thing you would have moved differently for next uh, for, uh, last turn? No, not at all. Thank you, though. Yeah, that That's was just me being stupid. stupid. So everyone, my entire thought process right there was I was wrong. <laughs> I want two dudes to be able to shoot you. You want two guys to be able to shoot me? Well, two guys to be able to overwatch me. Beep, 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 beep. See, these two gentlemen. Let's be like. Oh. So, I mean, I... Oh, just for range? Oh, like for uh, shooting these guys. Ah, I see, I see, I see. Like, so that you can't overwatch me with too much stuff. Yep, seems reasonable. Question is, do we try to blink some at uh, Mr. Mars Raj? Mr. Marzi. Everything else does. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm going to an RTT tomorrow, and I am going to stop on some baby seals. If, uh, we go like here. <laughs> Rodney says that was a two cats fled the room. Wah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, shut up, guys! I've got, I've, I've got, I've got a very, very masculine wah. Karina, they're making fun of my wa. They're they're calling me Wa Luigi. <laughs> I like it. It's a prude. My wife's favorite things is listening to chat talk shit to me. Which, by the way, during the tournament, I've already decided that if you guys know Felix, you've seen him on several streams. He's gonna be playing against a guy in our Discord who have been talking mad shit to each other. So there will be a NSFW uh, stream where you guys can super chat in, and we will allow you to hop onto a voice and and. Insult these people with your own actual voices. Oh my. Uh, he might desperate. He's gonna desperate. He's fine. Okay. Oh, 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 these don't want to move. That doesn't want to move. Why would I want to move, Shadow? Because, uh, pew pew. What do you, what do you mean, pew pew? And some significant uh, pewings and pewings. I will, however, offer you a fine bait. A fine bait? Oh my. Will you overwatch? I'm actually really game? tempted to overwatch that because just killing that would be actually pretty useful for me. And it, uh. Well, it's not necessarily a bait, but it's giving you like a hard decision. Yeah, I'm not going to. I'd much rather just stop you from moving everything else. Fair enough. One one of the one of the things about Overwatch guys is one of the one of the, the tools isn't necessarily killing the things that moves, it's stopping other things from moving. 
So yeah. saving your Overwatch can be a lot more valuable than just killing something in Overwatch, if that makes sense. Because if I had killed this thing, then he would have been free to go ahead and move all this stuff, which he didn't want to do. <laughs> Let's see. I believe that I want to rid the world of Gretchen. Please still have range there. Please still have range there. This is all fine and a dandy. Yes, sir. We are still in range here, which is fine. Because they have the best keyword in the world. What's that? Grenades! Ah, nice. So, let's see. Can we get... Can this somehow fit there? Nah, you're with me. I would have to move those gentlemen first. Yeah. Which means the Overwatch is a thing. Mm hmm? Ha ha ha. Excuse me. Do I then accept it to start doing the trades? I believe I will. Okay, I'll just go and do my Overwatch then. No, I'm not going to move. I'm, oh, you're, oh, you're I'm, not? Oh, you're I'm, no, I'm going to no. accept the trading back and forth with Oh, okay, with gotcha. Those. Gotcha. So this thing ultimately goes away and doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Well, let's start of round four, not round three. Yeah. Oh yeah, but I mean, like you'll you'll get a zero on it now. Correct, correct. So now it's, then, it's out of the game, and then start of my turn. It doesn't matter, right? So this yeah, thing exactly. is now gone. So yeah, um, that is there. That is there. I have one thing left, and that is these need to come out to play. Play, play. <clears throat> play is gonna play. We will come over here. Yeah, that seems reasonable. <clears throat> Looks good. I'll just do this for you. You move six. I'm gonna start oh, so turning some of these auras move. off now because it's getting a little, a little much on the old eyes here. Let's see, you go to here. So ultimately, I can't get too much away, but you will be heavily damaged this turn. Um, twenty-four means most of those will get to shoot. There is no way here. There is no way to significantly avoid it. Let's see, not the alpha. So I think we will take it. And then just have you have target saturation. That is definitely a strategy. So my hope this turn is that Moz takes uh, a grenade to the face. Seems reasonable to me. Go, and then these guys will be able to move six, and I'll get on the objective behind this, so that you can't shoot me with the flash kits. And then if, for some reason, some of these are alive, which they very well, with the very well should, then I can charge here and keep you contained for yep. another turn. Makes sense. All about containment and doing just enough. Containment and doing the stuff. Yes, sir. All right. Uh, this dune. Oh, uh, let's start with the grenades because we might as well. Makes sense. Boop. Die, Mr. Mazrog. Take four. Yeah, he's dead. Does he blow? Up? He does. Uh, it's good so me. my war boss takes a wound. One of my hogs. I'll roll a five up for them. I lose a wound on the sterilizers. Yeah. Hog takes a wound. Snag is six up, so they're safe. Uh, one wound on the gets. Let's put on this dude. And I think that's it. Yeah, that'll be it. Well, no, oh, and he's done. Right. <laughs> and Moss, that's, that's true. <laughs> There's that little thing too. This Doom Runner will shoot at the, um, the guys over there. Yep. 
So the thing about the grenades keyword, guys, the grenade stratagem does not require you to be eligible to shoot. You just have to have not shot. So the linked two, two cents, links. please. Five ups, save both. Very good. Um, these vanguards now, do they see your whole boss? Your claw is a bit tall, I believe. Uh, might see with a... the latter half, like the latter of like four dudes here. Yeah, I that think is... here, I'm just going to pick this up. And go ahead and measure it with me picking that up, so you can actually see. Yeah, I think no, like I, I, I went down to infantry level, and these three models can see you. I mean, you, you mean uh, without crossing that line, because that line's that line you have drawn is moving through the building right now. Oh, that's the different line, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then it would be. You need to draw a new line. Yeah. Just, just draw it. See what you can draw through. Yeah, these. Here. Yeah, that'll work. So it looks like you got four, and then the the long gun. No, it'll be these back here because the other ones are close, too close. Okay. I can't actually, I can't like physically see above the Dune Rider. Cookie. Okay. Then so let's it'll be yeah, keep two you. of those and the Archibus. Two of those and the Archibus. Two of those. Uh, the other ones do not have any interesting targets. Okay. Four up. Two wounds. All right, takes a wound. And then the Archibus. No. Nope. Um, we will do these vanguards into. Well, let's do these first for what it's worth. Mm -hmm. uh, everything up here into there, everything down here into here. Cool. I'll minus one to win my gets. Yes, sir. Archibus. Marshal. Arc rifle. Marshal. That is. One wood, strength seven. Yeah, so it, maybe level. two, I believe, because you are in your deployment zone with some dudes. Damage. Uh, damage is D three. So have, one, one dies. On yeah, one was one. I forgot about that. Yep. yep. The caliber. T five minus one wound. Nope, nothing. Mm -hmm. and then uh, it should be eighteen plus two pistols. Going into the grunts. Marshal. Mm -hmm. And then Twos. force. Twos. No, anti-infantry force. Yeah, but cross only have toughness too. Oh, so it would be threes then, because mine's one to wound. Oh, so how many threes just to wound? Uh, one. Just one. Okay, that's fine. Right. There we go. Five us. AP one, ignore cover, because yeah. I think you're stretched far enough behind for the... Go for. Yeah, let me see. No, it wouldn't be AP one. Doesn't matter. Didn't oh, because you have a five up anyway. Yeah, <laughs> that's irrelevant. Silly Gretchen. Pistols. Nope, nothing. Okay. No, no, actually, that's a wound from the, Oh, it's uh, minus one to wound, though. Oh, yeah, minus one, minus one, of course. Of course. They are T2 minus one. There we go. Um, shoot a shot to sterilize it first, probably. Uh, no, only the alpha is out of range still, so that's fine. Oh, right. I should pull those guys. Whoops. I forgot those two, these dudes existed. Mm, we both did. Mm -hmm. 33. Mm -hmm. uh, dice, please, dice. Where are we? There we are. Uh, it'll be force, right? Uh, I don't know. T two minus one wound. Oh, so we'll be threes. Okay. Uh, there'll be five more. Okay. There we go. Right. AP one. No, AP nothing. Ignore AP nothing. Then we'll just start on that there runt herd, but you do ignore his cover. Yes, sir. So he's got two wounds. All right. So he dead. And then. I think we just have six scrots left. And these guys. That's four of them. So four die. Oh, it's out of us. Yeah, I just let them die for no reason. Once again, lack of prioritization, like a dumb person. And then a six ups. Uh, he's dead, because he has six. He's fine. Okay. So if I had just been paying any attention at all, guys, I would have just killed these guys first and made them out of range to shoot me. And uh, that was just stupid. <clears throat> oh, that's the scoot and shoot. So yeah. because you're doing this before you the... shot them? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. Like we discussed. That's why you always discuss your intentions mm -hmm. with the thing of a genius. Absolutely. So now he's just doing the scoot and shoot he had, he had mentioned earlier. He's not taking any liberties here. He had said that he wanted to move them. 
and we're just trying to move a little bit faster now because the game's been going on a little bit, so it's easy to skip over steps. Old man Jonathan needs his bed dying. No, baby, I'm all I'm all hopped up now. I got a wad. Let's see, and we will be like right here with him, so we can't get any further. Don't tell me no. what I can't do. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Shot, shot, and then we have that guy remaining. Um, you are minus one to wound on these kids. I am. And you have a lot of attacks. I do. And he is also annoying. Because he has eight attacks this turn, right? No, nine, nine, nine. Four attacks base, Three. plus four plus four for his ability, plus one for the wall, so up to nine. Ah, yes. So, let's be prudent and do, 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 do these into the kits. Mm -hmm. Archibus, wound, that's a wound, AP. Is it strength seven? AP. Yep. All right, damage. Damage is... Kills one. Two. Arc rifle. Uh, one wood. Strength? Uh, seven. Okay. Safe. And then, uh, Caliber. Marshall. That's a wood. Safe. Did he die? Uh, oh. Mm. Nope. Mm. And then, 18. Marshall. If you want, ignore cover. One, two, three, four, five. And that might sink it now. And then uh, this Dune Rider will try to get rid of the war boss. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, let's do. God, which that's the safe deploy. I should probably do the safe deploy just in case you destroy it. Yeah. So let's do it with this Dune Rider. Shooting there with minus one to hit. Oh, okay. That'll be five through all. Four. It'd be nothing. All right. Uh, and I do. I don't get cover, so that's going to be two wins on it. Mm -hmm. uh, you are not dead. That is... Fine, to be honest. Um, I will just... Yeah, don't have CP2 intervene. I will just let him live and do what he does. Um, that one is going to Homer. Mm -hmm. So three and three again. I am going to charge you here, though. Makes sense. Uh, did I shoot with that Dune Rider? Uh, yeah, you shot them uh, into the pits. Mm. No, I wouldn't shoot him with six. I think I left him because I started with them mm. and then... I don't remember. I don't think it matters. I'm just going to charge you. Charge away. It should have been the onus on me to mark it in some That's way. six. I do not need to block you any more than this, I believe. Then that. There we go. I think like, at most it's gonna be like a twelve eight something to me. Uh, yeah, looks looks fairly reasonable because I think I'm I am gonna hold this in the end. Um, I, I believe so because I can't I can't deal with the squiggle boys. That's why it it's so important for me to just lock them in for like four turns. Yeah, exactly. Three four turns. Um, I guess uh, fights. It's like three. And fire of oh, uh, force, yep, two wounds on the save him. All right, you good, you fight. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. right, now, a lot of your tools are gone. Blah 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 blah. blah. Yeah, exactly. There is roll. There we go. Uh, three explosions, two two, winning of fives, seven saves if you want. That's a lot. Take three. And then Bedrock, Full House, two more saves if you want. Damage. Two, one each. 
Yes, sir. That okay. Is... Oh, they have 11. I thought they had 10. Yeah. And that's the end of your... Uh, here. Oh, I right. Technically fight first, I suppose. I didn't even remember that we were in melee. Uh, no wounds. That's, that's why I shot with him instead of him. Yeah, I gotcha. Because there's a there's a chance that um you take me away. Right. Right, so you go for the safe play because you know it'll be guaranteed three points, yada yada. Mm -hmm. Make sure he's in. So he won't be able to pile in. So that'll be uh four of them. It's gonna be twenty attacks. Threes, three explosions. Uh, toughness what? Uh, nine. All right, so threes, eleven AP two damage. Three. Threes? Are you strength ten? Yep, on the wall. All right, I thought it was strength eight. Yeah. AP yeah, two, right? Yeah. Yep, that's sixteen damage. That was a spool. I explode. So going for my knobs first. Uh, let's see. He's out, so it is only your knobs that are of concern for you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, three. Let's kill uh, the vanguards. Three. Uh, let's see. That guy. Mm -hmm. And then the other vehicle. Three. Mm, big dice. Don't you get out disembark first? Oh shit, there's dude. <laughs> I'm comfortable if you want them to die, but I don't know. I feel. I try, 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 try. Yeah. I totally forgot. Let's do like this for you. Thank you, Mr. Jonathan. Oh yeah. Um, do you get any charge bonuses with them? Nope. Alright. So let's do... You know, I forgot that. So I definitely believe waiting till turn three to wall was correct. There's no reason for me to have walled in turn two, except for making Michael Ford happy earlier, which, you know, of course that would have been there we go. a good reason. Uh, I don't think I lost anything. No, I've lost a plasma cover. Just uh, one. one more. Uh, I'll just put that by. Doesn't matter, they will die next turn, presumably. No, I wouldn't kill them. Alright, there we go. Uh, you can't pile into anything except for down here. And I can't get within range of them. Uh, so I think I'll just stay where I am. Fair enough. Okay, uh, that works. And onto my turn. Let's see what I draw. Indeed, there's a 30 point difference now. So if you do the math, right? Defend and extend, so I could definitely get both of those this turn. Yeah, extend should be doable there. Extend should be super doable. Um, cool. Defend definitely. Yep, yep. So if you just if you just do it quickly, right? You'll get an eight and zero mm -hmm. primary. Um. So I'll just advance this red truck here. And okay. then next turn, I will. Probably have enough vanguards left to deny you that. Two, so you won't you won't get eight. Three. So then it's fifteen. So with the seconders, I don't believe you can catch me up. Well, I'm not sure that's true, so I'm gonna go ahead and play it. Uh this guy'll just come right here. Then this thing with regards to like how we would report this to any potential WTC captain style stuff. Sure, sure, sure. I'll advance the war boss. Would you like to overwatch him? Uh, no, that's fine. Cool. All right, so he'll go twelve. That's ten. I get him two here. Then, oh, I guess I gotta stay outside of that thing, so I'll be there. And then these hogs and my snaggas. So I'll go ahead and move my hogs. Yeah, so let's just advance the hogs, because there's no reason not to. So we'll go 15. 3. That's 9. 
then I'm just going to roll up like this, and he'll come like four, and then six, and then we'll just do like this, outside of one. Basically, they're all just going to be right here. Yes, sir. Outside of one. All right here. And you'll be right there. And then you'll be right here. And then these dudes will go and advance. Then we put some colors to differentiate. Yeah, that makes sense. It's a good call. This truck will do like this. And I'll advance this truck as well. So we'll go 18, which is actually very good for me. So then this will be a two and a half inch rotation. And then that will be here. Put a little or out. So that's three inches of movement. So that's going to be like four. Or, yeah, we'll call that four. Then I got to rotate a little bit less. So we'll call it five. Then we'll go with a. 10 inch move and then I oh geez 10 and then that's gonna put me at 13 and I got five more inches to move I'm gonna go so do you move 18 did you say yeah Very that's cool. an extra three because I rolled a six on my advance Very nice I got a one and a two okay um then I will advance my beast and I guess see where they need to go so they get to move 10 inches. Um, 10 inches for them is actually pretty annoying. So they'll basically just be here. And I'm moving them up backwards a little bit just so I guarantee these things die. For a shooting or a charge? Yes, right. Um, and I think that's all of the movement I have. Oh, wait, no, I got these storm boys. Would you like to overwatch them? No, sir. Okay. So let's come right here. And then it is the shooting phase. Uh, so, Bad Rock will shoot his pistol, why not? He gets to reroll that, he missed. And then we'll go with all these guys. They'll all shoot this track, so you should be all of them. Yep, so that's going to be 10 pistols. And they're going to hit you all on sixes. Pew pew, three hits. They're going to wound you on fours. Two wounds, AP nothing. Two wounds. Let's see it! Yoy. One takes a wound. Three shots for the beast boss. All missed. Alright. Uh... Then we'll have, that's basically all good in the hood. I uh, don't need, even need to bother shooting any of them. Do you want to move these, by the way? No, nah, I don't really want you to overwatch me with those flamers right there, I think. Fair enough. Uh, I'm just going to charge you with the truck first, and then I'm going to charge them in. And uh, yeah, just remove them, remove them from the game, I believe. Well, it depends on if these beast nag is like, I should have read that a little bit more intelligently, but that's okay. Um... Yeah, because I'll just charge them, I think, five, six inches here, or five inches there. Yep, makes sense. And, uh, then I'll pile in to wipe that squad as well. Yep. Uh, okay, cool. So, any other shooting? I'll shoot all these squig hogs at the Scorpius mm -hmm. on eight wounds. Yeah, I mean, basically, my my, cont my containment now is, is done. So now yeah. it's essentially me trying to, like, shenanigans survive the points. Just one AP one. Which is what we talked about, right? With yeah, the yeah. whole... Um, Two damage. Uh, thingamajig. Uh, then storm boys and shoot their pistols. I do boss. have a grenade available on the war boss. Just so you are aware. Yeah, uh, he's probably just gonna charge in here because I don't want to kill them because I want to charge in and kill them with the war boss Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, but he might actually throw his grenades at the Dune Stalker and then just kill that as well. Yeah, that's that's why I was thinking. That actually makes a lot of sense. If you wanted to do that. Uh, I have how many CP? I got two. 
I don't need to reroll any charges here. I actually might want to reroll, and I, that doesn't really help me all that yeah, much. Yeah, you might want that reroll, right? Yeah, exactly. So I'm not going to do that, and I might want it unbridled somewhere. Okay, cool. So that's going to be all the shooting. Let's go ahead and do our charge. I'm just going to charge right here. This is a three inch charge. Yes, sir. Cool. It's a nine. I assume you are declaring. Both oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll pop like that, and then we'll be here with my storm boys going on in. They need a two. They make it on that. Yes, sir. Which be here. Pew, pew. Let's see if they can do a little better job this turn around. They get a second try. Rarely do storm boys ever get a second try. Uh, he's going to charge all three, so he's just he just has too much move, so it's okay. Cool. You are definitely whipping. Um, and then my hogs will just go straight forward. Did you want to roll for maybe some potential extra move, or are you like completely blocked? I'm completely blocked here. There's nothing I can do. Yeah, fair enough. So there's no reason to roll it. Well, no That's reason. No point, I suppose. I guess there's always reason. I love rolling bucklets of dice. I'm an orc player, right? Uh, I'll roll this truck into your dudes. So he's there. Uh, yeah, so no overwatch, so forth, yada yada. Yep, yep. I'll roll. Um, now I'll go ahead and roll the snagas. They have that five inch. I assume, and they... I assume you go into both. Yeah, yeah. Um, yes, sir. And then we'll do that. Right, that's the eight. That's what I wanted to see. More than enough. Debut. And then you can go eight here. Here. You want to declare them as well? No, I didn't, because that would have been too farther. Exactly. So but I'll, I'll be piling into them. Of course, of course. Yeah. That's basically how I had that more or less planned out. Then the rest will just be stringing for coherency here. Oh, uh, I do think I want to get that knob up there. Uh, we'll put that one back here, and we'll do bring this guy back up here. He'll be there, and then... The rest of these guys have eight inches, so you can stand here. Do you believe you have enough to yeah. remove enough models that I don't sort of remove the OC here? I think so, yeah. Because all I mean, of us, because everyone here is OC I two. Because everyone yeah, so here I, is OC I, two. I take you down to OC one, and I am OC two myself. Yeah, yeah, but these guys will wipe this squad. This squad should get wiped as well because I'm winning yeah, on two. I, I, I mean, I assume it depends on positioning and stuff eventually. Yeah, so I think I've got it. Um, and then yeah. uh, these knobs. Man, I think I want to wipe these guys so that you don't take them behind. It's probably yes, better. Sir. So they'll, they'll do the 4-inch. And they get the 10. So then that'll be basically no problem. And that is why I did not overwatch. Why is what you did not overwatch? To give them a uh, feel of pain. Oh, that makes sense to me. Cool, good there. And I think that's all the charges. Did I miss anything? Cool, that's good. And then we'll just go ahead and do it. You don't have interrupt, right? There's no reason why you would anyway. So I will start with the hogs. They will wipe all the blues. They are all yep. fighting. Do you want to just pick those blues up? Because they're... Um, I do have a five up uh, in roll. Well, in that case, then I should roll it. So that's going to be six times four, which is 24. And then hit you on twos. And I assume they... Wow, that's a lot of ones. And one explosion, and then twos. All right, so that's going to be 17 AP2, AP1 damage too. That's dead. That is 11, so one wound left on him, and then he's just going to yeah. die. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, not you, you. Cool. Then we'll do this. Uh, actually, I think it's probably fine for me just to not do that. So then we'll pile in. With the snagas, uh, I think I need and to have this guy like this. Yeah, so he'll be like that, and then you're. T he'll be I mean, he was within range to hit anyway. Yeah. So. Okay. Well, that's fine. Then I won't need to do that. So that's it. So I've got one normal dude. He's got four. Or we'll just do the, the snag enough. He's got hits on twos. All hit wins on twos. Four saves. AP one damage two. Dead. Then I won't roll the other one. And oh, I should have done the pylons over here first. Sorry about that. Sorry guys, I'm just moving a little quickly. Then he would have to come right here for coherency purposes. You can come like that. So then I've got four oh. snagas, right? Yeah. Then I've got four snagas and the beast boss. We'll do the four snagas first. That's gonna be sixteen attacks. Do you want a carnage? Uh I should, yeah, that's true. Hit you on twos. Oh, 
And that's going to be five explosions, so full house, and then winning on twos. All right, 13 saves, AP1 damage one. That's them. All right. And then they can stay right where they are. And then we'll do the Storm Boys. That's going to be four times uh, four, which is 16 attacks. They'll hit you on threes. So just dropped one. That was really good. Then the wound on twos. That's full house. That's 15 AP1. Yes, sir. Ten. That is them. Yeah, so now it's can I actually catch it? Uh, you'll get an eight. I'll get an eight. Well, depending on what happens here, but you'll have enough OC without that, I think. Yeah. The war boss could whiff. He could. Uh, so he's going to put everything into that squad. So we'll do his two attack squeaks first. Both hits. Both wound. AP nothing. Damage one. Uh, they are extra attacks. So they oh, I guess that's last. Both. Yeah. Then we'll do but, the... Yeah, but I saved yeah. them both. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, then dropped one of the claws. Winning on twos. All right, that's going to be eight AP two. Phew! Save four. Save nice. Four. Only cut four. That's, that's actually pretty good for you. Let's see. I don't think falling back or not matters. Um, so I'll just make sure I have enough in range. Yep. And then, um, yeah, these guys do their consolidation. And then these guys do... No, they're not tagging, so we're just consolidating those guys closer. But we will put these guys on the objective right there. Uh, do you have to go into engagement range if you consolidate them? Oh, right, I do, actually, because of that. That's true. You're right. I don't have a choice there. You're correct. Um, And then truck, I don't actually care what it does, so I'm not going to hit those. Yeah, makes sense. And over here, I will roll these knobs. You're yep, going to pain it. point for feeling pain, of course. Makes sense. So I have, I think you killed one of these guys, so I've got just four of them, so that's four times four is 16. Dropped one. Hitting you all on threes. All right, that's going to give me two explosions. When you on twos. All right, drop two. 11 saves, AP two damage two. Yes, sir. In twos. Mm -hmm. uh, lives on one, lives <laughs> dies. Jesus. One dies, two Dead. dies, Dead. three dies. Wow, that's a pretty good little series there. One, two, three. And then we'll do the war boss. He's going to hit you on twos. I dropped three of them. Twos. All right, that's going to be six more saves. Fives. <laughs> okay. That was a good. That was a good. Save. Wow! Again. Okay. That that's typically what the sterilizers do. They Dude, don't do a that was an overperformance right there. <laughs> and they then the two live. attack squeaks. Both hit. Both wound on the attack squeaks. Wow. Saved. Cool. I mean, to be fair, I only needed one to live, right? For the for the behind. No, that's true. Then we'll just do this one. Try in here. Oh, yeah, it doesn't matter who's in. And then he'll hit yeah. you with his tracks. All missed. And then winning you with the racquetball. One hits. No wounds. Cool. And all right, that's all I can do there. Uh, uh, you can take me with the Scorpius. To, uh, coherence. Okay, cool. And then you can hit me with the Scorpius if you want. It doesn't really matter all that much. It doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah, I'll, just I'll roll my gets, there. though, because... Um, all uh, right, so that's going to be three hits. And then six saves, AP1. Take three. And then bad rock. One more save, AP1. Good. Cool. All right, uh, so that is going to be the end of the turn for me. So I do score extend. Yes, sir. And that'll I've already eight. scored. Oh, okay, perfect. And then we'll go on into your turn. You'll get an eight. Like so, um, da -da 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 -da. Uh, we can be very quick here. It basically depends on what my what my secondary draws are, right? I see that thing goes away. You, well, I might stop an eight. Um, let's do battle shock there. Mm -hmm. it matters for if anyone dies. That's a fail. Uh, four dudes. As long as one lives, they all live. But, oh, but you failed, so you can't score. No, I can't. Behind scores. Oh, that's right, you said. Oh, shit, jeez. 
That's not thing. Right, right, right. Just gonna That's a really good thing there. for if, if everyone who watches, if you remember that, that behind enemy lines does not require, that's a pretty good thing. I'm just going to pull it up so you can all read on screen. That's actually pretty cool. 12, not 8. Let's see. Uh, this Dune Rider will pull back. Okay. Probably something like this. Yeah, I get a little rotation so that works. You're good. Yeah, I'll just straight away. Straight yeah, yeah, down that's good enough. To trigger anything. And we need a one inch, a one inch, a one inch. Mm. There. So I can get six on it or something. Mm -hmm. uh, I will advance these. I believe. Oh, no, you are within one. Mm -hmm. So I actually needed to pull him. Thought I was outside. Yeah, it's cool. Just put a different one in. It's no stress. Yeah, I'll, I'll Let's just put him down somewhere else. Yeah, you're cool. Yeah. And we will advance because charging doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Is that safe? There it works. It's another one. That's uh, right. Yeah, just the two. That will not be enough. That is not enough. She will get an eight. Mm -hmm. Should we just talk it out from then? Yeah, I think we can talk it out from here. Yeah, because uh, then I can I can just You'll just follow these guys back over so you'll be in position to get yeah, another behind. These, these guys will obviously Homer this turn. Yep. And so you'll get three on Homers this turn. These guys will fall back. Yeah, yeah get prepared. prepared. So next turn my snaggers will probably charge and kill them. Yeah, I mean these guys will go twelve and then just like try to set up for like doing a homer behind here afterwards. Yeah, so yeah, so uh, over here, yeah, all I'll this... I'll just be running everything up here, basically. Right, that makes sense. So, so there, can... there, there will at least be a behind next mm -hmm. turn. So let's go and see. Think... Yeah, you'll you'll get behind for one squad, I think. Yeah, I think uh... I think there's, there's going to be at least like one squad behind. I am unsure on Teleport Homer. Uh, engage and investigate. I'll spend a CP to get rid of investigate, I think. Yeah, engage, you'll probably... Actually, investigate, I can probably score pretty well, can't I? Because that'll give me two, that'll give me two. So that'll give me four. four yeah. No, I can't advance charger here, so that's only four. Four four is fine, right? Yeah, and then... So I'll get four on that, I'll get four on engage. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh, four, not. Yeah, there we go. And then it would be eight. eight. Yep. There. Ah! It's okay. <laughs> and then uh, these guys just moved over here, right? So I just need to roll to see if I kill them so that you don't get that next behind deploy. Yeah, and they'll obviously do the field of pains and everything. Yeah. So this thing's dead. This um, squad would also be moving, like, here-ish. That's cool. So these guys get to move on up here. They'll all move like this. So they'll shoot and charge into those boys. Um, that one doesn't necessarily die. Okay. Did you fall back last turn? Uh, no, I did not. Okay. Well, then I'll roll to see if I kill you. Yep. Because that is a very good point. Four attacks each. Twelve. All right. Two wounds if you won. Pick one. And bad rock. Two wounds if you won. Uh, one at a time. So then he's good. All so right. Then don't shoot with them. Okay. So then he's still here. Yeah. No problems with that. That works. So then. Obviously, like this guy would have just shot at him. Yeah, that's cool. I say he's dead. I'm fine with that. Uh, these guys are immediately dead. Yep. Um. Then this will die in my turn. Yep. So then turn five, you'll. Just and then whatever. these snags all come back here, and they're going to kill the shit out of these boys. They move eight inches. There. And give them the two CP to advance and charge. So they'll charge in all unbridled carnage here. I'll roll these attacks. Yep. So that's going to be uh, Beast Boss, or the uh, knob first. You're going to be on a Fiona Pain here. Yes, sir. All hits. And one, one extra for the explosion. That's going to be uh, 
toughness four, but you're minus one because bad work's gonna be close by. So it's gonna be five saves, AP one damage two. Uh, five saves. Okay. AP one, right? Yeah. Yes, sir. Damage two. So yeah, all five two. of those, all those wounded you. You don't have a three. One, up. Two. Oh, that's right. I keep forgetting. Uh, <laughs> I removed three, right? Yeah. No, you removed two, so five wins. So ten, ten damage total. And the whip. And mm -hmm. then uh, one on one after this, mm -hmm. he dies, another one dies. So okay. it should be four dead. Now I got three times ten for 30 attacks from the Snagas. Hit you on twos. Dropped a bunch of ones, six explosions. When you on twos. Alright, that's gonna be twenty six saves, AP one, damage one. Fives. Fives doesn't matter, right? Right, this is irrelevant. So like that, fifteen should be E. That's seven. Seven and one's on one. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's ten. Yep. There you go. You don't pile anything. Nope. So that's done. And then I'll draw my secondaries for the last turn. Yep. Storm then I and assassinate. Get, and I, I would be able to get the homer with this squad. And I'll get five on Storm and I'll get five on assassinate. And we get a perfect freaking draw. <laughs> yeah, that's, 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 uh... that's awesome, dude. That's super funny. <laughs> Guys, yeah, thanks so much for walking. This was great, dude. 70 70, perfect draw. <laughs> so I am still undefeated with Admech. Hey, this listen. Is my worst, this is my worst result with them, which I expected because, um, like we meant, like we talked yep. about before the stream, <laughs> pressure armies like this totally ha can just run me over because I can't shoot you out. I think you're. I think in teams we never put you into works because when I go first here, you're completely boned. Yeah. Because I I do my scout move first, and then you can't lock me in. I think you're just completely mm -hmm. screwed. Mm -hmm. So as if this is a teams, we never make this pairings for you. No, I, I think that as long as you have something like the Squig Hog Boys, which I can't necessarily deal with, yep. um, I think we just pick whatever the other one is. But this is a very safe, like, first defender. Oh, this is a great first defender guy. Totally. Absolutely. I like it, man. This is a cool... I mean, it's super frustrating to play against, but it's cool. And it's it's very... Um, it's very heavy on the on the on, on the uh, heavy on the brain to play. It is, I believe that this is this would actually be pretty ch tough to to take the WTC. I think. No, like I I could do it. But yeah, I know you I can, couldn't... but you got a big old brain, so. Yeah, I but I couldn't do anything else. Right. Guys, this was awesome. Thanks so much for joining. This one went a little bit long. We we did a lot of teaching here, but we really appreciate you hanging out with us all today. This is freaking great. This was ended up being a tie. Uh, after we, we we went through the last round there a little bit fast. Sorry if we were mumbling there a little bit. Uh, but this was awesome. This was a Friday night stream. Thanks so much, Shetel. Thanks so much for coming on. You're always a wealth of knowledge. We love having and you. I guess we will have to find the best admin another day. We will have to find the truest crumper another day. This is awesome. Guys, we'd love to see you in the Happy Crumping Wargaming TTS tournament. It's going to be five rounds. Uh, it's starting two days after the data slate. If you want to register, you need to be a member. You can find my link on Coffee down below in the description, and you can sign up there. It's just $4 a month, but it means the world to me because it helps me bring this content to you. I am actually trying really hard to go full-time content creation right now um because i'm having a blast with this and it seems like some people are getting some good value out of this so i'm gonna i'm gonna keep it up and uh we'll hope to see you guys in the tournament until next time bye bye